Hey bud, how's it going? If you're new to the channel, then welcome. Take a seat. And if you're coming back, Dorian, there is a bit of magic in everyone. Except for you. Welcome back to another movie commentary. My name is Sam. Steph. And we're, we're the, the movie, movie buds. buds. This is a pretty good movie. I only watched it for the first time like a couple of years ago, actually, for Halloween. Yeah, I think we all yeah, watched yeah. it at your apartment. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, so that was honestly probably like the fourth or fifth time I've seen it. Oh, uh, you didn't know, it. yeah. Because it was a classic on TV back in the day, so I yeah. watched reruns of it when I was a kid, obviously. It's a classic film. I really enjoy it. It is super corny. Yeah. But that is a good thing. I feel like sometimes people think that I hate everything just because it's corny or cheesy, and that's not true. I mean, it's quite the opposite. He f really, really likes corny and cheesy f All right. Yeah, see, this is the good kind of cheese. It's appropriate for the time. It's a kid's movie from 1993. Oh yeah, that's right, Sarah Jessica Parker's in this. That's correct, yeah. Young Sarah J. So I guess this would have been, what, like five or six years before Sex in the City? Maybe? I don't even know when Sex in the City started. <laughs> Late 90s. Yeah. I think it was like 98 or so. Yeah, somebody uh, in the comments let me know when Sex in the City started. Oh, sh Crazy ladies flying into your backyard. Emily? 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 No one else hears that? The singing? That person back there not hearing anything? Elijah, pass to see my Wait. sister Emily. I think the singing is just part of the soundtrack music. But look. They conjure. Oh god. The woods! No, it's not. I, I think I remember that part. They're actually like luring the kids with the song. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. <sighs> She's done for. Oh, okay. Not yet! You wake my father, summon the elders, go! <laughs> <laughs> that is the best acting I've seen in a while. <laughs> Ooh. Oh. Oh, oh but that's a rough tumble. Yep. <laughs> Welcome to the tumble. We got Funny, when I was a kid, I didn't really understand why falling down a hill was like so bad. And then it happened uh, to me and I was like, oh wow, that sucked. <laughs> Cause like, it's not just that it hurts, but you get like nauseous from all the rolling. Yeah. Somebody's yeah. got like no weapons either. Couldn't have taken the time to just grab a pitchfork. Just gonna beat the <laughs> shit out of them with his ponytail. <laughs> That's great. Oh god. Oh look, another glorious morning. Makes me sick. Oh uh, dude, those fake teeth are so good. Yeah. Must have been a limp. My darling. We must continue with our little guest of honor has arrived. Wake up, darling. Oh, oh right. I got the Necronomicon happening. Yeah. <laughs> Mary? Right here, right here. Better hope that eye doesn't ever need to have necronomic contacts. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, man. Tis time! Bring to a full rolling bubble two drops of oil of boil. She fucking like opens it on a page and it's like chicken parmigiana. I like, oh shit, <laughs> wrong, wrong book, wrong book. <laughs> With the herb that's red. And a dash of pox. And a dead man's toe. Dead man's toe. And a dead man's toe. Dead man's toe. That's a lot of excitement for a toe. Yeah. She likes the toes, dude. They're her favorite part. Yeah. Oh, God. She's one of those. She's a toe person. Yes. <laughs> oh, God. Will you to stop that? I need to concentrate. Yeah, definitely stop that. That's gross. Yeah. She needs to concentrate. Fuck, they do a good job of playing the crazy. Yeah. They have it up so good. Uh, I smell a child. What does thou call that? A child. <laughs> See, I feel like the reason this gets away with all of the cheese is because it's kind of the point. It is. Gather and a bit of thine own tongue. That's why I'm a little bit worried when I heard that they were going to try and do a remake of this. Ah, uh, you feel like they would lose that special corniness. They would 100% lose it. They would probably try to make it too serious. And it's like, bruh, not everything has to be serious. One drop of this and her life will be mine. Yeah, man, that's definitely what happened with the Evil Dead reboot, at least to me. It was just like kind of a regular horror with the same storyline. Yeah. All right, girl. Open up your mouth. Supper's on. No! <gasps> oh, boy! Now, uh, this poor, brave son of a bitch. I knew I smelled a boy. I can't <laughs> 
stab him with the spoon. I love how he's fucking dodging. God, this is good. Get away from my potion! Oh! Ah! Yeah. Ah! My potion! Ooh. That one burns so hard. Yeah, that is a boiling hot pot. Bro, your hands. Emily! Ah! Oh. <laughs> oh, shit. Ah, oh, shit. She's a Sith Lord. Hmm. Ah! <laughs> that was golden, yeah. God, I really hope that little flick was improvised. Tis her life force. We will share her. I love how the little girl just looks so unimpressed. Yeah. Like, wow. Can't believe my brother sucks this much. <laughs> <laughs> How do they manage to make a child murder so hilarious? Just great acting. What can I say? I am beautiful. We're young. <laughs> <laughs> yes, girls. Well, younger. But it's a star. <laughs> <laughs> it's something. You hag. There are not enough children in the world to make thee young and beautiful. Cold. Rough. Sisters, did you hear? Yeah, what he called you. <laughs> sure. Yeah. Whatever shall we do with him? Hang him on a hook and let me play with him. No. Oh, God. Ew. Book, come to mommy. His punishment must be more lingering. Oh, that's right. They turn him into a cat, don't they? Let's see. Amnesia, bunions, children's oh. cholera. Wait, is he the cat or the dead guy? No, he's the cat. Right, so I can't remember who the dead guy is. Different dude, I think. Perfect. His punishment shall not be too. Die. I think you're right. He is the cat. Yeah. But to live forever with his guilt. As a cat, yeah. There you go. I mean, a cat would be pretty good, though. Yeah. I mean, if it had to be any animal. Yeah, I know, right? She could have turned him into, like, a worm. Yeah. A freaking cockroach. Something that's more likely to get killed repeatedly. <laughs> well, I mean, maybe the idea is with bugs, like, they don't have enough brain power for him to understand what's happening. So it's not really a punishment. I don't know. He understands everything as a cat. Well, yeah, but the cat has a bigger brain than a cockroach. Not enough to talk. I know. I'm just I'm trying. <laughs> <laughs> don't try. That's not the point of this movie, okay? <laughs> Quite the opposite, actually. Yeah, true. We are just three kindly old spits, ladies. Sucking the lives of little children. Winifred Sanderson. Eh? <laughs> yes? What hast thou done with my son? I don't know. Cat's got my tongue. <laughs> It's terribly uncomfortable. Yeah, it would be. Yeah. I silent Mercury, you a fire. Listen to them not! <laughs> A good one. Definitely don't drop the book. I know. Why didn't you just burn it? One old Halloween Eve. A virgin summon us. She's making it pretty clear that letting the book open was a mistake. I know. We shall be back. You had so much time to kill them, seriously. And the lives of all the children shall be mine. Lots of time. True story. They were like, oh, it's a pretty good dramatic speech, though. Yeah. <laughs> Loving those hot topic socks. Aww. Away, beast! Aww, how could you shoo him away? He's so cute. I know, man. Now there are those who say a black cat warning off any who might make the witches come back. <laughs> <laughs> Throw this shit in your face. We seem to have a skeptic in our midst. I wasn't even scared. I was just like, what the fuck? Yeah, God, the teacher's assaulting me. <laughs> Care to share your laid back California? You guys here in Salem are all into these witches and stuff. Stuff? It's just too laid back and tie dyed. Halloween was invented by the candy company. Halloween is based on the ancient feast called All Hallows Eve. Yeah, you ignorant fuck. It's the one night of the year where the spirits of the dead can return to Earth. Well said, Allison. Sure, that explains everything. Oh, yeah. That made it cool. Yeah. In case Jimi Hendrix shows up, here's my number. That's a. Um. That's a bold move. I can't tell if I love it or hate it. Yeah. I mean, he's kind of putting himself out there. He's, I think he's kind of making it work. A little arrogant, but I like it. Yeah. I mean, it's more like he's putting himself in a position where he could be absolutely destroyed in front of everybody, you know? Yeah. It's a tough position to be in. Mm. It's good when it works out, though. True. Hey, bro, you already gave her your number. You don't need to chase her down. Allison. Hi. Hi, look, um... He does feel the need, though. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to embarrass you in class. You didn't. Oh, at least it's to apologize. Yeah, valid. Must be a big change for you. Yeah, that's for sure. You don't like it here? The leaves are... 
great, but those leaves quality. I don't know. Just all this Halloween stuff. You don't believe in it? I love her hoodie. Yeah. The Sanderson sisters? No way. Wait, is it even a hoodie? Or does it just have a weird I think it's a poncho. Not even on Halloween. Especially not on Halloween. Trick or treat? I think it's just a shirt with an interesting No, it's a hoodie. There you go. Big ass hood. I was right. I love it. It's a Jedi robe. That's why I love it. Oh, she gave it back. Ooh, brutal, my guy. Luckily, you go to school with her. Yes, same class and everything. Yeah, you'll see her around. A little bit different when you're an adult and you get a girl's number and, like, accidentally lose it or something. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what they made phones for. Yeah, I uh, didn't always put it straight in the phone. My bad. Oh, silly bastard. Well, I learned, obviously. <laughs> Paul, who are you? Max, just moved here. From where? Los Angeles. What? Guys. Yeah. LA. Oh, dude. Tubular. I'm Jay. This is Ernie. My name ain't Ernie no more. It's Ice. Dude, really? Ice? Your name is, oh no, Ernie. It's uh, pretty indicative of where his life is gonna go. This is Ice. Holy <laughs> shit. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. He did that. Let's have a butt. No thanks, I don't smoke. You got any cash? Hollywood? These guys are just a fucking lot. Yeah. No. We don't get any smokes from you. We don't get any cash. What am I supposed to do with my afternoon? I mean, it's right on the back of your head, man. Maybe you could learn to breathe through your nose. Ooh, that's a good one. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Check out the new cross trainers. Let me try them on. They won't fit you. <laughs> yeah, probably not. Later, dude! Oh, fucking bummer. My guy. He really should have just rode off before they started talking. Yeah, he should have just kept going and not stopped. Like, when you saw these two dudes pop up, why were you like, yeah, I'm gonna stick around? Oh, uh, yeah, two dudes in a graveyard. This is definitely gonna go down well. I should get to know these guys. Hey, man! Sucked. Watch your language. What the hell is he supposed to say if not it sucked? Yeah, day one. He wasn't wearing any shoes. Must be some form of protest. Gosh darn and golly, it was terrible, mom and dad. <laughs> Mother, I just had the worst day. May I be excused from the room? The most atrocious day. <laughs> Also, what the hell, Dad? He comes home with no shoes and he says, Oh, it's about to be a form of protest. Get your shit together. Yeah. Hey, guys. Bedroom intruder lurking in your closet. <sighs> oh, Allison. There's one thing I remember back in the day. This dude has the sick room with like the extension up the top. Oh, yeah. <laughs> ah, sister. Trust. I scared you. Ha 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 ha. You did good, kid. Yeah, well done. Kiss me, I'm Allison. <laughs> <laughs> I think that was the more embarrassing part. Mm. Guess what? You're gonna think you trick or treating. Not this year, Danny. What? Mom said you have to. She can take you. Dude, there's only so many years you can take your kid sister trick or treating. You're eight, go by yourself. Eight? Dude. Wait, what? He's like, you're eight, you can go by yourself. No, she can't. I'll get lost. Man, times have changed. The full moon outside. The weirdos are out. Yeah, she's right. The weirdos are out. Yeah, they are. You just ran into some of them in the graveyard. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Come on, we used to have so much fun together trick or treating. It'll be like old times. Yeah, well, the old days are dead. Bruh. It's dead. It doesn't matter what you say, you're taking me. Wanna bet? Okay. <laughs> yeah, run away from this eight-year-old girl. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> wow. Yep. Let's go hurry up. The bewitching hour is about to begin. That's <laughs> very scary. Wow! <laughs> Oh, come on, cool guy. Lighten up. Wow. Sunglasses at night. What about you, Max? Who are you supposed to be? A rap singer. <laughs> oh. Well, your hat should be on sideways, shouldn't it? Oh my god. He's correct. Yeah. It is 1993. <laughs> god damn, I'm so fucking envious of the states for this. Trick or treating. Just Halloween in general. Yeah. It's such a cool holiday, and Aussies just suck so bad at it. Yeah, the absolute minimal effort that goes into like costumes and decorations for Halloween stuff. I know. Let's just go this way. Oof, bro. <laughs> Smashing pumpkins. Ding ding. Stop and pay the toll, kid. Dump out your sack. Drop dead. More. Whoa! How'd you like to be hung off that telephone pole? Yeah. I mean, then like call the cops? <laughs> I've got my big brother with me. Oh shit. I've actually got a question for any of the people who were like this age in the early 90s, late 80s, and that is... <laughs> oh no! Did teenage boys really try and bully small girls like this? I mean, I'm sure some of them did. So, you're doing a little trick-or-treating. I've seen lots of bullying, sure, but usually it's like the big boys versus the small boys, not the big boys versus the little girls. Yeah. 
Whoa! Uh, sorry, it's just weird. No, I get you, because, like, having gone to a boy's school, if it got around that you were, like, bullying a little girl, they would just call you weak because they're a bunch of sexist teenage boys. Yeah, yeah, that's the kind of point I'm trying to make. What are you supposed to be? A new kid on the block? Sick. He's a little leaguer! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! I have to say, the only dude here who looks like a new kid on the block is Ice. Yeah, actually. Come on, Daniel, let's go. In Hollywood, the shoes fit great. How do they fit great? You must be at least two sizes bigger than him. Yeah. You should have punched him. He would have killed me. He used to have died like a man. Oh my god, seriously? You just humiliated me in front of half the guys at school. She's an eight-year-old girl. True. Collect your candy and get out of my life. And that is a bit harsh. I want to yeah. go home now. That's 100. Like, it's one thing to be, I don't know, embarrassed or whatever. But, like, dude. You're making her cry. What are you doing? This is your little sister. Like. There you go. Like, I know he's a good enough guy to figure it out. Yeah, of course. It's just frustrating because he tried to get them to go around. I miss yeah. all my friends. And doing that whole, my older sibling will beat you up thing is always like, please no. Mm, definitely don't do, do that to your siblings. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I want to go home. This is your home now. Get used to it. Yeah, that'd be so rough. Mm. Having your life uprooted like that. Sure. Yeah, I'll admit that never happened to me, so. Give me one more chance. Why should I? Because I'm your brother. <laughs> and he's trying. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, check that out. Something just flew across the moon. <laughs> <laughs> Nice. There you go. Let's go, jerk face. Bond healed. Yes. <sighs> Let's move on. Get more candy. Yes. The Rich people. Good pick. Mm -hmm. Trick or treat. Trick or treat. Yeah, sure. Just come into these people's homes. Max Dennison. I see. Oh, Allison. <laughs> Kid, come on. Be cool. You're killing me here. Just be cool, please. <laughs> I'm just taking my little sister Danny around. I'll get you all the candy you want. Just shut up. <laughs> my parents made him. <laughs> wow, of all the cool things you could dress up as for Halloween, you're just going to choose the lamest era in fashion and history. Just honestly, this party is kind of creeping me out. So, um, how's the party? Boring. It's just a bunch of my parents' friends. They do this every year. I'm sure they do. Little eyes wide shut. By the way, Danny, I love your costume. Thank you. I really like yours, too. I couldn't wear anything like that because I don't have any... What do you call them, Max? Oh. Yabos? <laughs> yabos? Max likes your yabos. In fact, he loves them. Dude! Oh. Dude, yeah, that's not something... Why? Okay, she seems to be tickled by it though, so that's great. That's fortunate. <laughs> Very fortunate. I'm really into witches. We just learned about those sisters in school. I know all about them. My mom used to run the museum, but they shut it down because a lot of spooky things happened there. And because it was really boring? Yeah, the lack of tourism. <laughs> yeah. Why don't we go to this old Sanderson house? Come on, make a believer out of me. Okay, let me get changed. Yeah, make a believer out of me. <laughs> oh God. What a line. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Buddy, calm down. Uh, I'm not going up there. My friend told me all about that place. It's weird. Right, you just threw him under the bus so hard. Do him a solid. This is the girl of my dreams. Take her to the movies like a normal person. Danny! Look, do this one thing for me and I'll do anything you say. Please. Bruh. All the candy you want. I know, right? <laughs> Next year we go trick-or-treating as Wendy and Peter Pan. Oh, Jesus. With tights or it's no deal. Oh, God. Aren't Wendy and Peter a couple? Okay, okay, deal. Yeah, they are. That's always weird. Yeah. Legend has it that a hundred children are buried within these walls. I know she doesn't get the context of that because she's eight. I hope so. <laughs> but it's gonna be weird for him. Yeah. Or like when <laughs> couples cosplay as two characters that are related. Mm -hmm. And it's like, oh, no, guys, you didn't do your research. <laughs> or they did. Yeah, oh, oh. Surprised it wasn't blocked off or anything. I guess people just fucking abandoned this place and forgot about it. Everybody else knows not to come here. Yeah. I can't see a thing. Well, there's a light switch around here somewhere. Surprised no one burnt it down. Oh, they tended it to a museum, you know, make some money out of it. No, but they're like the original people that were left behind, right? Yeah, right? It was like a whole village there. <laughs> Found a lighter. I love how they always pull out like a lighter and that illuminates the whole fucking room for them. Yeah. It just sets fires to the cobwebs. <laughs> wow. Well, mission accomplished. There you go. All right, kids, you've only got so much time to unleash this curse, so get it done. Come on, virgin, hop to it. <laughs> oh, fuck. 
That's right. Yeah, they were very specific. Yeah, yeah, they were. This is the spell book of Winifred Sanderson. It was given to her by the devil himself. I mean, okay, even if they didn't burn down the house, why did they not burn the book? No idea. The book is bound in human skin. It contains the recipes for her most powerful spells. Yeah, that sounds like the Necronomicon. I get the picture. This kid's just so unimpressed. What's that? It's the Black Flame. Wait, have you seen The Evil Dead yet? No. Oh, man. I think I saw part of the remake. Yeah, the remake is just an average horror movie. Yeah, it was just like, oh, yeah. Black flame candle made from the fat of a hangman. <laughs> on a full moon, it will raise the dead when lit by a virgin on Halloween night. Bro, don't light it. So stay away from that thing. Don't light it. Dude, we all know. Come on, dude, it's okay. So let's light the sucker and meet the old broads. Okay, well, at least he's admitting. Yeah, I know. I love how he's just kind of outing himself on the spot. <laughs> Stupid cat! It's okay, he's like 16. Yeah, but it's not the kind of thing you advertise when you are 16. Okay, Matt, it's uh, time to go. Oh, come on, it's just a bunch of hocus pocus. It's time to go! I know, when you're 16, you think it's a big deal that you're a virgin. <laughs> oh my god, I haven't lost my virginity yet! This is so lame! Little do you know that half the people who said they have are lying. <laughs> Absolutely bullshitting. Max, no! Uh-oh. Bro. Oh, what a dick. Come on, man. You're 100% virgin. This is a bad idea. Yeah. <laughs> He's like extra virgin somehow. <laughs> Braises them even faster. Yeah. Extra virgin olive oil in his pocket too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Turns out this is all just some lighting effects that like the museum people put in there. Oh, that would be so cool. <laughs> Such a good Halloween prank. There's just some security guy waiting down there to scare them. <laughs> like at long last. <laughs> what happened? A virgin lit the candle. Oh no. Good one, dickhead. Oh, buddy. I love how they're just looking around, not like leaving or any shit like that. Mm. <laughs> we are home. Oh, well, you know, they're a little freaked out, so. Yeah, mildly. <gasps> Wake up. Wake up, sleepyhead. Oh, <laughs> he's had a nap. Aww. A real long nap. <laughs> I smell children. I mean, one child, two teenagers. It's a little girl. <gasps> Maybe eight? And a half. Oh, let's play with her. Come, little children. Wow, she's like a child bloodhound. Yeah. I thought that would never come, sisters. Oh, wow, she's smooth. Mm. It was I who brought you back. Imagine. <laughs> and she's so well fed, isn't she? <laughs> Shishka, baby. <laughs> okay. We have been gone 300 years. Ooh, how time flies, huh? When you're dead. <laughs> Why is the kid laughing? <laughs> it's been great fun, but I better be going. Stay for supper. I'm not hungry. But we are. Yeah, that's kind of the idea. Yeah. Hey! Look on my little sister. You got this, bud. No, he does not got this. You don't got this. Emperor Palpatine's sister fucked him off. You! I haven't lost my touch! Yeah, definitely not. Goodbye. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> I love how she was just standing there with the electricity waiting for the kid to smack her with yeah. a book. I love that her sister was just watching the whole thing happen. Yeah. She was like, yeah. Get out! Go, go, go! Get out! Hey! What are you doing, buddy? You mess with the great and powerful Max. Wait. Now must suffer the consequences. Buddy, you're a little too, uh... Summon the burning rain of death. Convinced of your greatness here. <laughs> he makes fire in his hand. Bro. <laughs> Wait, are they... <laughs> nice buddy. going, Max. <laughs> Actually. There you go. Get the spell book. Take it all in. <laughs> <laughs> the burning rain of death! Yeah, come on, buddy. Ah, yeah, good call. Still the book. There you go. Solid plan. Huh. Yeah, they were really convinced of that death rain, despite the fact that they're really wet and nothing's wrong. Yeah. Confound it! Yeah, dude. Shut up! You guys didn't realize this earlier? They just, they just figured it out now. It is but water! Huh? Most refreshing. <laughs> Bro, that was... 
pretty easy trick to figure out though. They're like, come on, it's been ages since we had a freaking shower. Yeah. They're just so not used to water. This is a black river. Could you not see that it was solid though? Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> Ladies going out in the town. <laughs> uh, golden. This would have been so fun to film. Come on, this is the great. It's hollowed ground. Witches can't set foot here. Man, I gotta say, the effects on the cat actually hold up pretty well. Yeah, not bad for 93. I've seen much worse effects in much more recent movies. Oh, yeah. Over here. You know what does it though? The fact that the cat is black and it's dark. I want to show you something an idea of exactly what we're dealing with. Oh, uh, yeah. You don't see all the details. William Butcherson? Billy Butcherson was Winifred's lover. That's the zombie. She found him sporting with her sister Sarah, so she poisoned him and sewed his mouth shut with a dull needle. Winifred always was the jealous type. You're Thackeray Binks. Yes. Yep. So the legends are true. Come along. Well, yeah, no joke. Teenagers again. Hate Halloween. Yeah. Man, this is the worst night of the year. I can understand why, like, cops and firefighters would hate Halloween. Oh, yeah. I get that. And carry axes to chop the wood to burn us. Uh, hold me. What a pretty spider. <laughs> oh, God. Let me make one thing perfectly clear. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. Uh, the magic. You know what I love about this? Yeah. Someone was just like, what if the Three Stooges were witches. On all Hallow's Eve, when the sun comes up. I haven't seen the Three Stooges of any kind, so. Well, I'll tell you, that's just the premise of this whole movie. Okay, fair enough. The potion I brewed would keep us alive and young forever. Unfortunately, the recipe for that potion, the little wretches have stolen it. Therefore, it stands to reason, does it oh, not? Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> She's getting some protein in. Yeah, man. You gotta get your uh, nutrition. Find the book and then suck the lives out of the children of Salem before sunrise. Otherwise, it's curtains. Dost thou comprehend? Dost you, motherfuckers? You expand it beautifully the way you sort of started out with the adventure part and then you sort of slowly. Explain what? So, no, they don't. Because of me, my little sister's life was stolen. For years, I waited for my life to end so I could be reunited with my family. <laughs> You knew that this was a forever deal. I guess he wasn't paying attention. Fair. I'd failed Emily, but I wouldn't fail again. When Winifred and her sisters returned, I'd be there to stop them. For three centuries, I guarded the house on All Hallows Night when I knew some airhead virgin might light that candle. <laughs> Oh, well, it's told. We're talking about three-engine hags versus the 20th century. How bad can it be? Bad. Stay out of there! Yeah. Why? Have you dealt with magic before, dude? It's Satan's book. What do you mean, why? <laughs> oh, that's right. They do try. Yeah, well, I guess at least now we know why the book didn't get burnt. Yeah, fair enough. Maybe the same thing for the house. Mm, yeah, could be. It's just a bunch of hocus pocus. Fucking love it. Sarah. Brave little virgin who lit the candle. I love the color scheme, too. Yeah. I'll be thy friend. Take the fight! Not Thackeray Binks still alive. Gotta love the perpetual wind blowing their capes about. It's all about the ambiance. Well, and especially like the wind is blowing them, but not the teenagers in front of them. It's just their wind, okay? It's personalized. Thou will fail to save thy friends. Thou will fail to save thy sister. Oh, rough. I mean, they're not really friends. He just met these people. Yeah. He's like, no, I don't like them. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to redeem myself here, okay? This fucking klutz lit the candle. That's about it. They can't touch us here, right? They can't. Lover long since dead, asleep in thy wormy bed. But zombies can. Open thine eyes for the sky. On thy feet, so say I. I love how much of witchcraft relies on people waiting around for you to finish your spell. I love how much of it relies on just spitting hot rhymes. <laughs> <laughs> also, I never got why this guy would want to help her considering what she did to him. I'm assuming that he's being like compelled to somehow, but then I guess he just changes his mind, doesn't he? Yeah, doesn't he? I guess we'll figure this out. <gasps> Holy shit, it's Robert Smith. <laughs> Hello, Billy. Hmm. Wait, the cure on tour? Catch those children, get up. <laughs> get up, get out of that <laughs> ditch. Uh, the old ball and chain. <laughs> in here! <laughs> yes, hide in a crypt. Yep. Good plan. <laughs> the old tree branch situation. <laughs> Ooh. Wow. Didn't want a duck? Guess not. What 
is this place, Biggs? It's the old Salem crypt. It connects to the sewer and up to the street. This dude is fucking lighter. Yeah, dude, the lighter's really not helping that much. Ah, <laughs> uh, don't look up, Danny. Relax. I've hunted mice down here for years. Mice? What did you think he was eating? Cheese and crust. He's lost his head. Damn that faculty Biggs. I mean, he could have become someone's pet. True, he, but he didn't. Billy, how are those children, you maggot museum? Get my book. He's just like, no, no, no. I chose the mice. Yeah. I knew I could have easily become someone's pet. I just decided not to. Absolutely. Double down. Boom ho. Is that what she is? A broom ho? <laughs> <laughs> they're here. I know they're here. Get out of me. Sniff them out, Mary. There. There. Yeah, do it, Mary. Use that bloodhound nose of yours. Oh, I can't. They've gone too far. Oh. I've lost them. Oh. I'll have your guts oh. for garters. When Billy the Butcher gets here with my book, we should be ready. Sarah's just having a good time back there. Sarah! Yeah, just swinging on the fence. She's like, oh, we're doing stuff now? Oh, okay. Cool, let's go. Why? Because we want to live forever. <laughs> I love how much of the directing must have just been like, oh, and Sarah, you just do you. Just get high before every take. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Since this promises to be a most stressful evening, I suggest we form a calming circle. I am calm! Yep, super calm. Huh? Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I would watch an entire show just about these three. I'm sure a lot of people would. Ah! <laughs> yeah, the bus comes to kill you. Bubble, bubble, I'm in trouble. Oh, God. Buddy. I call it a bus. Did you have to spit out the window to say that? Yes, he did. And its purpose? To convey gorgeous creatures no. such as yourselves to your most forbidden desires. Oh, buddy. Okay. That's it. We desire children. <laughs> hey, that may take me a couple of tries, but I don't think that'd be a problem. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> this guy thinks he's getting some, what, witch foursome action? I need one of those instant ice packs. You girls are giving me a fever. Oh, Jesus Christ. Do you flirt with all of the women that come on the bus? You know he does. Yeah, well, flirt with slash, um... Creep on. Yes. But I guess they were into it. Yeah, I guess so. And you know what? At least he's willing to become a father. <laughs> Come on. Hey, Buttercup. Anybody ever tell you you're very easy on the eyes? I'm sure that they have. Yeah. Binks, look out! Yep, that's a bus. Whoa, <laughs> speed bump! Oh, he can't die. Yeah. Speed bump! Oh my god. All sad, even though you know his life is eternal. He said that. Yeah, no, it's pretty clear on that one. It's all my fault. Max, it's not your fault. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Look. The only thing that could have made it better was if he stuck like his little thumb into his mouth. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I hate it when that happens. What? I told you I can't die. Yeah. Yeah, he did say that. You guys just not listen to me? What the hell? <laughs> yeah, they definitely weren't listening. <laughs> Smell yeah, it's Halloween. There's gonna be a few of those out. Cupcakes, don't I get your phone number? Thou wouldst hate me in the morning. No, I wouldn't. Thou wouldst. Party pooper. <laughs> you know what, bud? You got off pretty light. Yeah, he really did. I'm pretty sure Bette Midler would have fucked you up if you kept going. 100%. What are those? What's that? The hubcopter. Oh, bless you. Aww. <laughs> 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 oh, that's right. Classic. <gasps> oh, such a good bit. I smell children, but I, I don't see children. I've lost my power. <laughs> enough, uh, enough. Sorry. Seriously, you're that dumb. <laughs> oh. <Master! laughs> oh my what kind of costumes are these? Help, we need guidance. The Sanderson sisters. At your service. Yes. Wow. Come into the non-smoking section. <laughs> You'd think the whole place would be a smoking section if it was hell. We need your help. What's the problem? We're being chased by witches and a zombie. Are we seriously gonna go with that? Well, you see, fr I, ju I just moved here. Not just, hey, three creepy adult women tried to kidnap my little sister. You see, it's like Hold this. Up. You see, he's trying to make it work. Yeah. And struggling hard. I broke into the old Sanderson house and I brought the witches back. Oh, um, buddy. Okay, you failed. See, I even have the book. No. Uh-huh. My guy. You lit the black flame candle. So what you really did was just admitted to breaking and entering and theft. Yeah, and now you're telling this grown ass man that you're a virgin. Okay, let's get on the sidewalk. Is that the kind of thing you want to tell to this guy? Yeah. And he's a virgin. <laughs> he's like, yeah, 
I know. <laughs> yeah. Come here. Oh, he's gonna give him some advice. Are you a virgin? <laughs> yes. Really? Look, I'll get a tattoo to my forehead, okay? See, not that big of a deal. I put my life on the line to protect this community, and you punks pulled it. <laughs> you just wanted to take a second and be like, are you sure you want to admit to this, my guy? Yeah, <laughs> buddy. You know, you don't have to advertise it. <laughs> There's no shame in it. But, you know, you can just keep that on the down low. Keep it bottled inside. <laughs> just bury it deep down so it festers and turns into rage. And one day, you could become a cop just like me. <laughs> Come on, Danny. Take that cat with you. What's so funny, Eddie? Why is that funny? Oh. Wait. Just a bunch of kids pulling my chain. Thought I was a real cop. It's a costume. Oh my god. Wait, is that illegal? Well, the thing is, he's not actually dressed like a cop. It's just a leather jacket with a badge and a helmet. <laughs> Oof. <laughs> Goodbye, fingers. <laughs> You managed to keep one? No. Oh, no, lost him. Would he have even felt that? I want you to meet the little woman. He has a little woman. That's tasty. <laughs> Bite size. Petunia Faye. What? We have company. <gasps> Satan has married Medusa. <laughs> <laughs> My three favorite witches. Are you broids a little old to be trick-or-treating? We'll be younger in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sure. Me too. Me three. Wow. Me through. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> oh, they just jacked their rights. Kids. Oh, kids. Next scene is just some kids hanging from the brooms like 300 feet in the air. Yeah. <laughs> no! Holy shit. Mom, help! Master, would thou dance with me? Oh, God. I am pretty sure he'd be stoked for the dancing, yeah. Yep. A daughter chamber. <laughs> Oh, so this is really a thing like random adults turn up to trick or treat at your house and you're like, yeah, come, come in and hang out. Let's get drinks. I mean, I really hope so. Okay, that's it, party's over. Maybe he thought he was going to get lucky. Maybe. <laughs> get out of my house. Oh, she's definitely worried. Then I get out of here. <laughs> Wooden face. Shove it, Satan. This ain't click, man. Thou should not speak to Master in such a manner. They call me Master. Oh, he loves it. Yes, I'm sure he does. Tart face? Take your clock bars and get out of my house. Make us. <laughs> <laughs> love the flourish in that. All of the extra flourishes are great. Oh, he's got a little costume. <laughs> Go, Ralph, do it. Okay, these witches are so scared by everything. How were they ever a problem to anybody? Yeah, they really are afraid of a lot of things. It's the chocolate-covered finger of a man named Clark. <laughs> 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 hey, candy. Why would the master give us candy? Because he is not our master. He isn't? These are not hot goblins. See? Oh, <laughs> Good move, kid. Yeah. Very smart. Stranger danger. All Hallows' Eve has become a night of frolic. Yeah, you catch on quick, don't you, Winnie? Ah, oh, damn, I got excited for a second. I was like, wait, is Alice Cooper in this? Look, for half a second, I thought the exact same thing. And then I was like, wait a minute. This isn't Wayne's World. No. Yeah, this is decidedly way more disappointing. Yeah, I know, right? I would have preferred if there were just a fake Alice Cooper. A dude dressed as Alice Cooper. Yeah, just a rock band playing Alice Cooper songs dressed like Alice Cooper. Right? Oh, oh, death. Something terrible happened. Danny, what's wrong? What, um... No, Danny's fine. Oh, buddy. Are you going to try and bring your dad into this? Yes. Come on, man. Mom? Nope. <laughs> yep. Oh, Madonna. Oh, uh, Madonna. Mom? Hmm? Oh, it is. <laughs> what are you supposed to be? Madonna. Well, obviously. <laughs> Honey, you weren't supposed to see this, I swear. Mm. Whatever it is, just tell me. <laughs> he thinks I've taken drugs or something. Yeah. My brother's a virgin. He lit the black flame candle. The witches are back from the dead and they're after us. How much candy have you had, honey? That's not how candy works. That, for one, but also, even if they're saying that they're witches, would you not be just a little bit concerned if your kid came up to you and said that three grown women are chasing them? Even if it's oh, it's a witch, it's a ghost. I'd be like, okay, yeah, I'm calling the cops. All you really hear is adults are chasing my eight-year-old around. Like, come on, guys. Oh, there's no Slither about. They <laughs> just flop on the ground and actually slither. Yes, you. No, don't try and draw her in specifically. I put a spell on you. Now you're mine. Oh, really? Is that so? Don't you see how crazy I am? Shit. Get out there and fight them! Fucking Elvis. <laughs> Here. Someone's always gonna be Elvis, right? Of course. And now you're mine. 
man. Sarah works fast. Uh, dude, that dude actually put effort into his mummy costume. Yeah, he did. You see the people that we know just like wrapping themselves up with some toilet paper? And like only a little bit? Yeah. Two? They don't even bother to go full body? No, he's just getting everybody worked up. Your kids are in danger. Oh, buddy, no. 300 years ago. Oh, God. Now they've returned from their grave. Man, I forgot about this. <laughs> And how fucking dumb do you have to be to think that you're like gonna convince a room full of adults that witches are coming after you? I know this sounds dumb, but they're here tonight. They're right over there. Oh, my guy. <gasps> wow. Oh, see, Thank you, Max. Now that everyone thinks it's a bit. Yeah, exactly. For that marvelous introduction. You see? I put a spell on you. To like, man, no one would be this campy and over the top while talking. You yep. can't stop the things I do. Yeah, see, everyone just thinks she's putting on an epic performance. Yeah. No! Don't oh, look at that! Been 300 years. Now the witch is back! And there's hell to pay. I'm glad we're getting some Bette Midler singing. Oh, yeah. Even if it's the more talky version of it. Good joke. Happy yeah. Halloween. Ah, oh, she's got a voice, though. <laughs> Well, yeah, once you hear her singing, you're like, yeah, let's do this. Yeah, 100%. Performance time. Holy fuck, we get to play with Bette Midler? This is great. Fucking A. <laughs> Put a spell on you. Backups? <laughs> of course. Oh, they're so ready. Yeah, they were prepped for this. <laughs> yeah, man. It's so good. And you know what? It's totally believable that she doesn't need a mic. Yeah. She's got that kind of voice. Yeah. <laughs> you could say it's magical. <laughs> get superstitious. Cover you. That is the best costume you guys have ever seen, huh? Yeah. <laughs> what? Oh, is everyone getting involved in the spell inadvertently? Oh yeah, they are. She actually put them under a spell. Yeah. Good times. <laughs> She's dancing. What the hell? Dance until you die. Well, unfortunately, now they are actually going to dance pretty much forever, right? Yeah. It's non-stop until the curse is over. Mom's going to go out of this world the way she came in. Voguing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on, man. Ugh, teenage rage! Calm down. Look, I want you to take Danny back to your house and don't let her out of your sight. I'm not leaving you. Yeah, but I don't know how well you can handle this one on your own. Uh-oh. Get out! Ah! Last man. Yes. I smell... Squad. Squad? Yeah, it's a bottom dweller. You cook it sometimes with lovely white oh, cream. Right. Lobster. Oh. Ah! Okay, like aside from the lightning bits, they mostly seem to be like normal women. I'm pretty sure if they yeah. just got like a pipe or maybe like a board or something, they could just like totally roll them. <laughs> I have an idea. Just sneak up behind them. Yeah. Fair. So, just... Quickly, I don't think Americans call it that. Oh, um, jump them? Yeah. Yeah, they'll jump them. What is this place? It reeks of children. It is a prison for children. That's true. Oh. Welcome to high school hell. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Get theatrical, man. This is definitely the movie for it. Yeah. It. <laughs> <laughs> I love how we put on the sunnies, despite the fact that he's the only one there. Yeah, yeah. Read any good spell books lately? walk they do what the hell is it yeah all of that synchronized movement god this would have been so much fun yeah they really must have rehearsed all those movements a lot oh no oh guys i am looking for a children's book you don't know where you are do you no you do though, right? Yes. Done pottery before. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, it's a kiln, so they're just gonna watch him burn alive, huh? Yeah. Damn, that's brutal. Makes sense. Although that does kind of feel like a win. What happened here? Yeah, I know. How did you guys fuck this up? I feel like you didn't stick around long enough to make sure you won. Yeah. 
I mean, what do you do to witches? You burn them. We did it, Binks. True. We stopped them. But you know, like, wait until they're burnt. Yeah, true. I mean, they did watch. For a little bit. You really miss her, don't you? Well, yeah. Yeah. Man, you can't keep blaming yourself for that. That happened so long ago. Take good care of Danny Max. You'll never know how precious she is until you lose her. I don't know if I'd say that it was his fault. No. He tried his best, man. He did. It was rough circumstances. Hey, Binks! Where do you think you're going? You're Denison now, buddy. Come on, Binks! Let's go home! Home. That is pretty nice. Mm. I like that they adopted him. It's sweet. Well, yeah, I mean, he deserves to have a family. Yeah. It's too bad it didn't happen earlier. Yeah. Dad! We got a new cat! Aww. Mom? He talks, I swear. Yeah. <laughs> shut up, shut up, shut up! <laughs> and then his whole thing is just making sure he never talks around the parents. Yeah. Nah, they're not dead, they're still dancing. Ah, uh, yep. You're my kitty now. You'll have milk and tuna fish every day. I mean, most cats are lactose intolerant, though, so... Yeah, it probably shouldn't. Like, they love it. They love milk. But they just shouldn't. <laughs> it's like dogs and chocolate. You know, Binks, I'll always take care of you. My children will take care of you, too. We found that out the hard way with our first cat. Oh. Yeah. Gave her a bit of milk the next day when we came home, the whole house just stank. Oh, okay, so she was just sick though. No, she was fine. She had just like- Oh, you just evacuated. Demolished the litter box. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she was perfectly fine. She was curled up on the couch, just content in the mess she had made. Shut out her guts and then just took a nap. Dropped her fucking bowels, man. <laughs> <laughs> Forever, ever. This kid falls asleep quick. Mm -hmm. Aww. And our boy Binks is just like, finally I'm warm. <laughs> no more sleeping in the dirt for me. That's right. <laughs> ah. Oh, okay. See, see this, this is what I was saying. Just respawned? Yeah, yeah, yeah. what's up with this? Hello, I want my boot. <laughs> Bonjour. <laughs> Bonjour. <laughs> Je veux mon livre. She's just so done. That's so great. You wanna smash some pumpkins? No. Nah. You wanna look in windows and watch babes undress? Oh, ew. Yeah. Uh, I don't understand why there are people who think that throwing toilet paper around like this is fun. I know. I don't feel so good. Cause you're eating too much candy, you oinker. Well, yeah, he definitely has just had too much candy. Yeah, that's probably true. <laughs> Yo, get your face off my shoe. Uh, wrong boy. Yeah, that is a bit weird. Yeah. Why was I cursed with such idiot sisters? That's a good question. Just lucky, I guess. <gasps> lucky? <laughs> How come it's always the ugly chicks that stay out late? Ooh, buddy. buddy. Not a smart one. Chicks. <laughs> Aww. Oh, that's great. It makes sense. Uh, I forgot that bit. That's brilliant. We should have to make the potion from memory. Let us out of here. We're really sorry. You're really cute. Hush! Oh, guy. You guys dug your own grave. Remember. Remember when you remember. Remember. As if that would help. Now I remember. Oh, okay, it did. Yeah. The book was there. Sarah, you were in the back dancing idiotically. <laughs> That's pretty much her role. I remember it like it was yesterday. Yes. Dead man's nose. Dead man's toes! She's trying to concentrate. Was it his gums? Oh, I don't know. Oh, dead man's <laughs> bun, didn't it? Dead man's buns. Dude, I love it. Whenever Sarah Jessica doesn't have a line, she's just being a weirdo in the background. Yeah, it's great. <laughs> I don't remember the ingredients. I've got to have my book! Uh, we will not! <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna Oh god, they keep spinning him and he's just puking in a circle. Yeah. Make thyself known. Oh, wherefore art thou book? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, okay, the book heard her. Yeah. I didn't realize it had an ear back there. Well, I mean, it was made out of human flesh. Maybe on the back cover there's an ear or something. Hi. Hi. God. Wait, you guys slept on the stairs? Yeah. Oh my God, it's five o'clock. <sighs> my parents are gonna kill me. The fuck were you on the stairs for? I think Danny was in the bed. But isn't there like a couch or something? I should go. I wish you could stay. Maybe. Well, not maybe. <laughs> Obviously, it's a couch. Poor Binks. Yeah, poor Binks. <laughs> Binks is like, I will outlive all of you. Yeah. Oh, yeah, very easily. Look, can we find some kind of way to help him? The book? Oh, you guys want to try and turn him back into a person? Just a little bit of casual Satanism to help out a friend.
friend. Yeah, why not dabble? The witch has used it to put the spell on him. Maybe there's a way in here to take it off. Binks told us not to open it. The witches are dead. What harm could it do? It's Satan's book. Like, what fucking part of that are you not getting? And hang on, wasn't she like the hella witch nerd? She like knew everything about the witches? Yeah, she is. Come on, Allison. Good one. Oh, you know what it is? She just wants to be the next witch. Oh, yeah, 100%. <laughs> <laughs> now I have the power. <laughs> Do you want to hit me with that cheer you up? <laughs> this is the end. No. I feel it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's right, because they need to get their shit sorted before the dawn, right? Pretty much, yes. It's 5 a.m. Depending on where they are, they got like maybe 20 minutes. Yeah. Goodbye, cruel world. Goodbye, bye, bye, cruel world. Goodbye to life. <laughs> God, this is so good. I oh, know. Goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye to all the <laughs> Goodbye, curtains. Goodbye, window. <laughs> Goodbye, little poofy things on the end of the curtains. Stop. They opened it. We just run our time while we're running out. We fly. Oh, great. So basically they sent out a homing beacon. Yes. Sweet. What's the worst that could happen? What could go wrong? <laughs> I love that her kid just be anything vaguely broom shaped. Yeah, she got a mop. Hold on, that's the best part. That's, that's right. right. <laughs> Thank you. I forgot about this. She's modernized. Winnie. Fuck it, whatever. It'll work, probably. Yeah, it'll do. Go for it. Yep, there you go. It does the trick. <laughs> <laughs> I love that they're totally unperturbed by the light coming out of this thing. I know. Only a circle of salt can protect thy victims. I don't think that's how you break a curse, though. No. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Binks has it. Binks has his shit together. Little too late. Just trying to help you. Well, don't. Nothing good can come from this book. You got it? Yeah. Bat, bat, bat. <laughs> <laughs> they do not got it. You might need to bat them in the face a few more times. <laughs> One more for good measure. Pa. <laughs> Maybe we should go now. Also, Circle of Salt. That brings up something I saw in a like post about Supernatural. Someone was like, why don't they just put salt inside some hula hoops and then just like hula hoop their way around? Oh, wow. And nothing can get to them. Oh, wow. As long as they're like, just keep hula hooping. That is an interesting point. Right? Circle of Salt. It works. <laughs> I'm with it. A good plan. Mom? Dad? Mm. That's a manicure that pays. Yeah. Still not home? You having a great time? Yeah. Dancing themselves to death. I don't know. Something's not right. I'd feel a lot safer if we had some salt. Something's not right because you opened the fucking satanic book. Yeah, that was definitely a bad idea. Gotta love the product placement. What product placement are you possibly talking about? I just feel like a 7-Up naturally. I just feel like the cool, refreshing taste of a 7-Up. It's like people only do things because they get paid. <laughs> So, what's it say? The former circle of salt to protect from witches and old boyfriends. Yeah, and what about new boyfriends? Oh, getting smooth. Okay. Do it, smooth guy. Fucking go with Godson. Nah. Oh, you fucking failure. Cock blocked by witches. Danny. Naturally. You sad boy. <laughs> you sad, sad bastard. <laughs> Fucking virgin move, classic. <laughs> he just wasn't laid back and tie-dyed enough, man. True. Max, the book is gone. I'm telling you something's weird. He's losing his edge ever since moving out of California. He just needs to get even more chill. Yeah, too bad there isn't Netflix there. <laughs> Danny, wake up. Oh, there goes the drum kit. Oh, man. <laughs> But it will not save thy friends. Come, sister. Dawn approaches. I'm pretty sure the salt circle has to be connected. Yeah, like a circle, you know? Like an actual circle. Not just like a, a sprinkling. <laughs> Holy crap. Jesus. <laughs> okay. I love the idea that they didn't have to do that. They just wanted to. They just wanted to, yeah. Fuck your house. The coolest fucking part of this room. We're going to destroy it. Yeah. <laughs> Renovate this, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Get up, kid. Don't worry about the drum kit. You probably couldn't play it anyway. <laughs> Use thy voice, Sarah. Bring the little brat to die. Yeah, he wasn't that bad. Was it? Oh, I, did, I just don't even remember was he playing before. Yeah, he was playing. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Goddamn, dude. Yeah. This is just kind of odd. Yeah. I mean, I love it. Great performance. I mean, it, it works. Honestly, I think it suits this movie so well. Oh, heavily. For sure it does. Like, I love that they just knew exactly what they were making. Well, you know, that's why it's a classic. They didn't try to do anything that was out of their... They stayed in their lane. Yeah, they really did. And it worked. Hey, you guys! Don't listen to her! The candle's magic will soon be spent. The black flame candle only brought them back for this one Halloween night. Unless they can steal the lives of children. How can we make the sun come up? 
Seriously? My guy. It's like past five in the morning. Seriously, take out the front row of kids, like pick them up and just tie them to a nearby fence or something. Just keep carrying them back one at a time. Oh, I mean, they'll kill Danny, but you know. Oh, right. Yeah, they have Danny. The children are coming. I love the implication that literally every single adult was at that party. Yeah. Hurry, okay? Oh, watch out. Nah, just run them down. <laughs> No one noticed their kids leaving the house. They did not. I'm gonna rout. Open up. No more candy, please. <laughs> Trying to fatten these dudes up. Yeah. I should be young and beautiful again forever. It doesn't matter how young or old you are. You're the ugliest thing that's ever lived. Yeah, that's right. You die first. Well, I mean, wasn't that always the plan for her to die first? Yeah. It's not like there was a line. Yeah. <laughs> Ew, you nasty. Yeah, well, seems like spitting in the potion is like a vital ingredient. Get ready! I open a mouth. Eddie, don't drink it! Shut up, yo! Oh, fucking obviously don't drink it. I mean, are you sure? I was really thirsty. It looks really good, though. <laughs> Prepare to die! <laughs> <laughs> Buddy. Wow. What was that line? Yeah. You have no powers here, you fool. <gasps> Maybe not. There's one thing that I know that you don't know. <gasps> and what is that, dude? <laughs> <laughs> nice. Brilliant. Do you like savings time? <laughs> I don't think the time actually makes a difference, though, does it? Oh, they're tricking. Yes. Nice. Oh, no. The pink, pink sun. <laughs> <laughs> right. And the light came on really quickly. I know, right? These witches are really dumb. It's not the first time they've fallen for this kind of bullshit, you know? Let me out of here. Hey! I'm out here. Tubular. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I love that. He just takes the shoes. Fuck you guys. So, yeah, fuck him. I'm going to leave you guys to die. Mm -hmm. Enjoy. That's what you get for stealing my shoes. Death. <laughs> I want to see you turn to dust. You want to see them turn to dust, but maybe you should leave. <laughs> Guys, you seriously are really easily taken for a ride, aren't you? Oh yeah, they're pretty thick. True story. <laughs> but I fucking love it. Hey, oh, the check of the game. You're always right, I don't know how It's you... my curse. <laughs> Look, the candle's almost out. In my potion. There's just enough left for one child. That candle burned fucking quick. Well, I mean, it's been burning all night. True. I don't know, magic candle. Wait, hold on. Those two dudes at the front were like grown men. They were like 20. Oh, but hey, they, maybe they were virgins. <laughs> no, I think they want children this time. <laughs> this is perfect for that little toe-headed brat. We have a child. Here. And look, Winnie, more children are arriving. Yeah, they do have a shitload of kids here. Yeah, hey. Winnie, we'll make more potion. We have the money. We have the time. I want to get that little rat-faced kid that called me! Ugly? Seriously though. Wait. Do you have the time? For real? Oh, honey. Yeah. <laughs> they really hurt my feelings! Oh, that's funny though. Come on, guys. <laughs> did you- Oh, you see that? Yes, I did. That's like I said, they're nasty. Yeah. Are they following us? But seriously, so many kids! <laughs> Should have picked any of them! No. Yeah, any of those kids would have done. She's like, no, we have to get the one that's furthest away from us. Why not just get her later? I know. Hello, let me see a driver's purse. Okay, she really does learn quick. <laughs> she does. Well, it's funny because she doesn't and she does at the same time. Yeah. Resisting arrest. She's picking things up here and there. <laughs> yeah, just randomly. <laughs> That would have been funny if he literally just ran one of them over. Yeah. Hurry, hurry! Go, 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 go! Come on! Oh, this guy. Oh, hey, it's uh, William, I think. Yes! No, wait, Danny! He just wants to be able to talk, man. Yeah. Just bring me that child, that daddy! Yeah, no, he's got other plans. Put some yeah. wiggle in it, you children, song! <gasps> Fucking finally. <laughs> oh, brutal. Oh, no. <laughs> He's like, fuck, my throat works. Wench. <gasps> Trollop. <laughs> Rock tooth. Firefly from hell. <laughs> <laughs> He's been waiting a while to get those out. I waited centuries to say that. Yeah. <laughs> yep, centuries. Say what you want, just don't breathe on me. <laughs> That's fair. I killed you once, I shall kill you again. I mean, he's kind of dead already. Yeah. I don't think he's that worried about it. He's so done with this shit. Next one! Next one! Move out of the way! Wait, 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 wait. no! He's a good zombie. <laughs> well, he's not a bad zombie. How about that? 
Come on. We'll have to hold them out until dawn. Hi, Billy. <laughs> the stench off that guy alone oh, yeah. would repel the shit out of you. You'd think so. You'll be safe in here. Okay, Danny? Yeah, fine. Um, oh, in the grave, I see. Yeah, that's a safe place. Ah, they're putting a circle of salt. Yeah, they can salt it easy. That's true. They could have just, just salted the whole bit around them. Yeah, go hard. Go like three times around, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Billy, go Danny, Max, Allison, spread out! You want to be sure that like something as simple as a light breeze isn't going to fuck you up. <laughs> Damn, undone by the weather. <laughs> Curses! For the last time, prepare to meet thy doom. She starts riding the baseball bat too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, stone in the face. There you go. Allison's using her fucking head. Yep. Go to hell. Yeah, she's trying to get something else to break the salt circle. Oh yeah, that would be smart. <laughs> I love that he's just waiting. Ooh. Come on, man. Seriously just stood there waiting for his head to get kicked off. Yeah. You could just, oh, out of salt. That's unfortunate. Billy, I think you dropped this. Hey, it's good to have friends. Yeah. Oh, come on, Danny. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, that's a good point. Okay, my bad. I was like, that was a smart decision, Danny. I'm like, oh, wait, no. No, it wasn't. <laughs> Poor decision. I'm sorry. <laughs> She's just sitting there just like, oh no, I guess I've been kidnapped. <laughs> yeah. Instead of like just, you know, punching her, kicking her, scratching her face. Yeah. <laughs> Anything. Ah! Hold on, Danny! And of course, it's up to Binks to save everyone again. Yep. This'll teach you to call people ugly. She's just calling it like she sees it. Oh, no, no! Just give it a few more minutes for Biggs to heal up. I know, right? Yeah. Then he can save your ass again. Yeah. Oh. You have to take me. What a fool to give up thy life. Yes, very foolish. Yeah, actually though. I mean, brave, you know, noble. Very noble, yes. Stupid though. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> can I just imagine what are you gonna do now? <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, see? Fight back a little bit. Yeah. Just like punch her. Yeah. Also, let go of the broom. You're not that high up, man. Yeah. You'll be fine. Yeah. You'll break an ankle at most. Yeah. Ah! Oh, no! <laughs> I love that she's got it on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Grab the cord. Yeah. Noise. <laughs> Undone by the 20th century again. I'm going to teach you a lesson you'll never Seriously, dude, just hit her and drop though. Yeah. I mean, I guess there's the danger of accidentally falling on one of the tombstones. Well, just falling on the hallowed ground. Oh, you know, I mean for the dude. Oh, right, yeah. Uh, what, what's his fucking name? <laughs> Who cares? <laughs> cool guy? He's the worst character. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I definitely gotta say the most um, interesting characters to me were um, William and Binks. Yes. I liked Allison too. And I like the kid too. Yeah, and, and, and Danny. You know what? We just like everyone except for that one dude. Everyone except for Hollywood. Hollywood, yeah. <laughs> That's what we're calling him. And to be fair, I don't really have any problems with Hollywood. He's just kind of forgettable. Yeah, I like he just didn't really need to be there. Somewhat. But I do like the protective brother storyline, I guess. Oh, the character development. That's good. Oh, yeah. Sing it out. Yeah. Let us hear that angel song one last time. Okay. Well, she makes a cool statue. Yeah. <laughs> Oh. oh no, they've decided to just deal with it uh, in mid-air. Yeah. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Why did they explode? Oh, because Winnie hid the hallowed ground. That's why she turned to stone. Oh, uh, right. Also, they spent all that money on that cool statue, so you know. <laughs> yeah, point taken. Aww. Plus, I'm sure they couldn't have built three statues, so. No. Not enough money for that. No. They put all that budget into animating Binx's face. Yeah. <laughs> 
You did it. Max. That was his fucking name. Oh, fuck. Okay, sure. Because of course it's Max. Yeah. Are you okay? Yeah, I think so. Don't worry, guys. You'll be able to tell that the curse is lifted because Binks is still dying and it's your fault. Yeah. You saved my life. Well, I had to. I'm your big brother. I love you, jerk face. I love you too. Oh. Is his shirt just like perfectly ripped? Yes. It looks like it's being cut. It's a new style now. Oh, I mean, it's a bit, it's a bit jacked up. Kinda. Does look like it was just cut with scissors though. Bye, Billy. Have a nice sleep. <laughs> yeah, Billy's like, yeah, finally. I'm out. I get to die properly. <laughs> Where's Binks? Hey, does someone want to fill in that grave? <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, it's just fucking under gravy. Just waiting for someone to come along and fucking steal his clothes and shit. Yeah. Binks. <laughs> He's gone, Danny. But he can't die, remember? Well, he couldn't until he hit that rock and then you lifted the curse. Yeah, exactly. Wake up, Binks. Wake up. Like last time. You guys just don't listen to Binks, do you? Really, they don't. Come on. He's done so much for you. Danny, please don't be sad for me. But then, what, we get Ghost Binks? Ghost Binks. Yeah, there you go. Ghost Binks. The witches are dead. My soul's finally free. Ah, oh, she can actually, okay, make contact. That is odd, but okay. You freed me, Danny. Thank you. Hey, Max, thanks for lighting the candle. Hey, Max, stop being such a fucking virgin. <laughs> that green, that green beans. Aw. Finally gets to chill with his sister again. Yeah. Who I would assume was like trapped in some kind of hell for the last 300 years. <laughs> Dude, don't say that. <laughs> I shall always be with you. Wasn't her soul eaten at the start? Yeah. Ooh. So. Look, I'm just gonna say purgatory at <laughs> best. Fair enough. Cause I, I really can't deal with that idea, dude. Sure. Limbo. Yeah, limbo. She was in limbo the whole time. Limbo wimbo. She was just asleep. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, Emily. I had to wait 300 years for a virgin to light a candle. <laughs> Fuck. Stop just roasting him for that. <laughs> just constantly reminding you. Just make sure everyone knows. Everyone in the afterlife is going to know about this. It's going to be great. <laughs> you know, Patrick Swayze and Ghost? Yeah, we're going to tell him too. <laughs> uh, classic. And now you're locked in here. <laughs> Oh, you guys finally get to go home. Oh my god. Oh shit, they really did just dance all night. Party hard. And they can't even fucking tell that they were under a spell of some kind. No. I thought LA was a party town. <laughs> So like, yeah, we just, we party like that. That's how we do. Oh, oh guys. Have you oh. guys figured out that if you swung closer together, you could probably let each other free? No, I don't think they did. They definitely haven't figured that out, no. Oh, of course, the book is still awake. Oh, yeah, I mean, no one killed the book. Yeah. Ah, uh, classic. That's a classic for a reason. Yeah, that's a fun movie. Yeah, that is heaps of fun. I'm sure that probably seems like I'm ripping on this movie a lot. But Both of us. Well, yeah, that's true. <laughs> but it's a great movie, man. I really enjoy it. Well, like, so you can like something and rip on it, you know? Just because we make fun of something yeah. doesn't mean that we dislike it. If anything, it's more likely that we do like it. <laughs> if I don't like or care about something that much, I probably won't rip on it. And there's a difference between joking about something and talking shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, for sure. So, yeah. you know. Just to be clear, we did enjoy this movie. We enjoyed this movie. It was great. It was really fun. We liked it. Was it. A very good time. Yeah, I would happily watch this again. We'll do like a rewatch next Halloween or something. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> One more time. Uh, one more, more time. time. <laughs> hey, buds. I hope you're doing well. And I hope you're enjoying this compilation. I just wanted to let you know that Maria and I have been posting our own movie commentary and reaction videos on our channel, which I'm going to be leaving links for in, in a card and top description wait top description yes <laughs> in the description and top pins and all that stuff so if you want to check out any videos that we've done you know where to find us hey bud how's it going if you're new to the channel then welcome take a seat and if you're coming back alicia when you said you wanted to rekindle an old flame i didn't think you meant arthur welcome back to another movie comment turning reaction my name is sam steph we're, we're the, the movie buds, buds. Hocus Pocus 2. We really enjoyed the first one. That was good stuff. Yeah, it's like super ridiculous, but in a good way. Your classic, yeah. campy, late 80s, early 90s movie. Oh. I always enjoy the classic Disney intro transition. Oh, I'm being a little different. She really is that witch. Okay, fancy bird. Calm down. I actually think it's pretty decent animation. Yeah, no, not bad. And if anything, it kind of feels like maybe they were trying to make it look just a little bit outdated. Might not have been. Might have just been the budget. But I don't know. I kind of like it if that was deliberate. Out of my way! <laughs> 
Oh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> That's right. You see them as kids in this one. I think they did the right choice focusing on their backstory a little bit. Come on, yeah, for real. Like, who are the real main characters of this franchise? No. Oh. Well, that was enough for me today. <laughs> <laughs> Make them away downtown. Faces pass and I'm homebound. <laughs> it's so over the top. I love it. Yeah. Surprise! This is the worst day of my life! Uh-oh. Devo. Look what we have made. They're used to it. I discovered a sow doll scrap pig suits and mix it with water. You did special stuff for your birthday. It's cool. Yeah. It creates mysterious goo. The Mary had the wonderful idea to mix a drop of goat's blood. She go left. <laughs> Taste is horny. That's brilliant. They're uh they're innovative. Yeah. I cannot eat. I am too troubled. Like, are we saying that they invented jelly? Turner boys off the in the Haber again? Worse. I've been told I'm getting old. I must marry John Pritchett. He sounds like a tool. Reverend Trask arranged it. Did Slee say no? Of course. Yeah, naturally. Then I took the Lord's name in vain. Oh, twice. <laughs> <laughs> She's so proud of that. They're doing such a good job at mimicking the mannerisms. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A truly wretched man can make me say such things. <gasps> you think it would be super fun for these kids to play this role. Oh, yeah. Let us forget the Reverend. Would Slee like to open thy presents? <laughs> <laughs> Presents make everything better. We search for the largest one we can find. <laughs> Ooh, brilliant. She's adorable. What shall we name it? Good thing she's the kind of girl who's stoked to get a spider in a box. Oh, tis the reverend. It's funny because you're supposed to be like, ew, gross, a spider. But I'm actually like, it is adorable, though. <laughs> I love spiders. Fair enough. They're friendly hands. We are not here. Most of the time. Yeah. Except for when they're not. Yeah, well, they're more scared of you than you are of them. Yes. Oh. <laughs> Everyone's here. Oh, God. Winifred Sanderson. So. I will mercifully give thee one more chance. Oh, yeah, this guy. Oh, right, okay. I always forget the actor's name, but he's funny. Atone for thy disgusting words. Agree to marry John. So we're making her a little more sympathetic here. Allow me a moment to reconsider. Yes, of course. She's fair. No. Oh, oh, praise God. <laughs> <laughs> I apologize, Reverend. He praised God. She is so ugly and unpleasant. I <laughs> oh, that worked some pride. The fellow is like, that's the polite way to say it. Yeah. <laughs> How dare thou say it so? Cannot speak that way to a man. I mean, they just don't like each other. It's fine. I refuse to marry that lout. It will be Billy Butcherson. Oh. Billy's like, hey, wait, what? Why me? Yeah. Because we are soulmates. Oh, okay. Since we shared that kiss in the graveyard. <laughs> Everyone's disgusted. He <laughs> relishes in petulant. Oh, God. Correct. Goodbye. I know it's over the top, but it's when you think about how accurate it was. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thou hast defied the authority of the church. It's not that far off. Thou shalt not do it here. A rotten apple quickly infects its neighbor. I, I kind of missed both times I've seen this now. Where are their parents? And we want no more like thee. Don't know. I didn't catch it. Yeah, Maybe okay. they're just dead. I banish thee from Salem. <laughs> okay. Well, they're banishing Banished. three orphan girls. I mean, into the maybe woods. by their standards, they're considered women, so, you know. Point. Mm. <laughs> and the spider's escaping. I know. The kind Smiths have agreed to take thy sister. Turn them right. All right, so her younger sisters are not yet women, so they're being adopted, but Winifred is just being kicked out. Yeah. No, 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 no. Oh, yeah, totally. Just have yeah. faith. <laughs> I love how the spider makes noises. Yeah. <laughs> I thought you were supposed to praise all of God's creatures. Hypocrite. Apparently he's one of Satan's creatures. Okay. To the forbidden one. What is forbidden? So they will not follow. <laughs> I mean, she had a good point. You'd think that they would have come across spiders, though. I mean, they think that they're all satanic. Maybe they know that that particular spider is very poisonous. Yeah, maybe. That's Stay close. Let's just pretend like they actually know their shit and they're scared I for mean, a reason. No, I can't. <laughs> this is when they had witch trials, so I just yeah. fundamentally can't. <laughs> Where are we? Never been this deep into the woods before. Perhaps we should form a calming circle. That will fix it. <sighs> That 70s show style. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they do like the full camera, like close up on each of their faces. Yeah. The reverend ah. screamed when he saw the spider. <laughs> what was that? Bigfoot, that you? I think Bigfoot would have heavier stomp, right? Funny enough, his feet, not that big. <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah, that's right. And then in the trailer, I saw there's like another witch, right? Mm. <laughs> The bird we were following earlier. Uh huh. <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah. Awesome. Just <laughs> chokes out a child. Thou look a thirsty child. That's how you introduce yourself to children. Yeah. <laughs> and I've never done that. <laughs> I was going to say I will. Yeah, <laughs> no. Not a good idea. Maybe don't. <laughs> Definitely don't do that. Why just thou come into my woods? They were going to take my sisters. Different from the other children I have eaten. Met. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Eat met. I mean, you met them and then you ate them. Yeah. So. It's an eaten meat. Mm. <laughs> they were right to fear thee. Thy temper. I do not have a temper. Thy. Is she for real? Oh, dude. Ugh, good God. Power. Yeah, yeah, totally. I get what they were going for. It's mm. still weird to mm. look at. <laughs> yes. This is a very sacred space for witches. We come here to charge magic. By eating kids. Yeah. <laughs> this altar is what makes Salem so special. Salem is dreadful. Only because it is run by fools. Don't argue with my dramatic cape. One day Salem will belong to us. Us? Which day is that going to be? I mean, like, did it though? Yeah. <laughs> Pretty sure that didn't work out. Yeah. Look, it's young book. <laughs> book, the glory days. Yeah. Magic has a way of uniting things that ought to be together. Happy 16th birthday, child. But I'm a witch. I know things. <laughs> Don't question me. Levitation spell? It's an apothecary book. It's one of father's. It's a spell book. Kind of an apothecary book, you know? Bit similar. It's a power spell. Interesting how... Let's do this one. <laughs> Winfred is the main one mm. who was chosen. Magicai Maxima makes a witch all powerful. Doomed is the witch that uses this spell. Promise thou shalt never do it. Wait, is she doomed or is she all powerful? It feels kind of cancel each other out. Yeah, it is a confusing thing. Because I said so. Book does not like it. Well, all right, if Book says so. I shall not do that spell, I promise. Well, Book does have some level of autonomy. Yes, a bit. Yeah. <laughs> he can move. Yeah, his eye. <laughs> he could fly. Oh, yeah, he could float. That's yeah, right. Because whenever he she calls him. Thing. I thought that he could only do that when she summoned him. I think it's more like he's literally just choosing to mm. go to her. Fair enough. All right. Book is strong and independent. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's more like they just have a close relationship. Yeah. You know? Thou art lucky to have each other. A witch is nothing without her coven. The world is not fond of witches. Can't imagine why. You eat kids. <laughs> Thou eateth children? Yeah. Yeah. See. How else does one stay ridiculously beautiful? Exercise, hydration, good sleep. A good know. skincare routine. She turns into leaves! What will we do with it, Winnie? Innate MILF genes. <laughs> Botox. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Mr. Buck. A good surgeon. <laughs> Shall we get some revenge? I guess Book is happy for revenge, so... Oh, yeah. The spell of smoke and flame. It's a culprit of Malika Mystica. <gasps> May fire rise! <gasps> yeah, I like that they made them a little more sympathetic, but didn't try to sell us on, no, they're the good guys. It's like, they still eat kids. <laughs> you, you can't really <laughs> redeem that. Yeah. Now we'll be together forever! <laughs> Satan's work, Oh, yeah, I guess you will be together forever. This is the work of the spider! <laughs> <laughs> this guy and his fucking spider. Yeah, I guess plus side is, if it's the work of the spider, then it's not their fault. This reminds me of that bit from The Simpsons where Bart's like, I want to come back as a butterfly because... Nobody ever suspects the butterfly. <laughs> <laughs> He's the graveyard legend of the dancing game. So this is another 29 years after the first one, right? Yeah. I always think that's cool when they do that. It feels more immersive. You yeah. Know? Well, same amount of time has passed and everything. Because you're not being taken out of it. It's especially noticeable with kids, obviously. Yeah. The Stranger Things problem. Mm, yeah, it's true. <laughs> Happy birthday! Yay. Birthday. Guess how old she is? Um, 16? Probably. I actually don't remember. Oh, right. I thought that was a genuine question. <laughs> so my mom is, of course, thrilled you're sleeping over tonight. Well, Susan loves an event. I'm like, shit, yeah, man. Maybe you could tell me. <laughs> I've never seen this. <laughs> hey, happy birthday. So what are you guys doing tonight? Chilling. Birthday rituals, scary movie marathon. Same as every year. Yeah. 
So this... awkwardly trying to cut her out. I decided to have two breakfasts. <laughs> Check out Ryan's car. We covered the entire thing in tinfoil. They don't like the boyfriend. I see. Because it's funny. <laughs> For basically that reason. Right. I mean, tinfoil is not the worst thing. Not the tinfoil specifically. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Why would she ask about her plans? She knows what we're doing. Maybe she was hoping you'd invite her? Yeah, maybe. She wanted to hang out with us on my birthday. She'd probably have hung out with us one other time in the last four months. Uh, okay, sure. She's kind of... Uh... She's been ghosting a little bit. Spending more time with her boyfriend who they mm. don't like. Yeah, fair enough. Yeah, it's always a difficult one. It is, yeah. What do you need good luck for? Ten bucks says we have a pop quiz today. So you want the luck for you to pass the quiz or so you don't have to do the quiz? Whichever one comes first. Either way, I guess. <laughs> uh, hey, Cassie. Uh, about tonight, I was... Dude, it's gonna be awesome. Our party at Cassie's. You're coming, right? We invited the whole grade, even Glenn. Oh. Yo, Glenn! Oh, no. Glenn! <laughs> what? So, Glenn. Um, you're throwing a party at <laughs> What the fuck? That's so, Glenn. <laughs> Just being pissed off at you. Your dad would never let you do that. It was my idea. I told you I wanted to talk to him about it first. Do you guys want to talk now? We don't have anything to talk about. Bro. Oh, man. Are you guys going to be busy doing witchery? <laughs> Most deaf, yes. What? We used to do witch stuff every Halloween. It's not witch stuff. Oh, God. And what's that? A good luck charm in case there's a pop quiz. I hope not. I didn't do the reading. Maybe you should have? Yeah, probably. This quintessential example of the worst kind of extrovert, this guy. <laughs> yeah, no clue. Dude, shut up. <laughs> Please shut up. <laughs> uh, to be clear... I love this guy. Okay, I've, this is my first impression. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just this situation. Oh, no. He's more or less what you think. He's okay. just hilarious. Okay, fair enough. In the context <laughs> of the movie, sure. Yeah. In real life, oh my God, I find <laughs> these kinds of people unbearable. Well, it's frustrating. <laughs> yes, frustrating, yeah. yes. Mm. And I do say the worst kind. That doesn't mean I dislike extroverts, period. In honor of Halloween, I've prepared the scariest class possible. Bet you have. A pop quiz. You knew that was going to happen. No, it was just a safe bet. Of course he'd give us a pop quiz on Halloween. I made an inference. Is that a spell? <laughs> okay, I can kind of see the charm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking idiot. Yeah. Oh, okay. Say that! What did you do? I'm pretty sure that was a recipe list. Yeah, right? <laughs> he was muttering some weird, scary language. Cacao, that's... <laughs> Coco. The world foods, yeah. It did sound like you said Satan. Satan. I was literally listing vegan food. See? Vegan food. <laughs> Witchcraft. Yeah. I'm calling it now. Most definitely. Principal's office, now. Quiet down. Oh, Fucking God. Puritans. The Puritans? <laughs> I didn't see Guys, that. Guys, no. <laughs> oh, and it's in Salem, too. Yeah, it's messed up. Ooh. Making sure Mike doesn't get lost? Yes, obviously she has to do that. Your dad is going to find out about your party. You're going to be grounded until at least college. Why do you care? You're not even coming. Because we just heard about it from Mike. As if that would have made any difference. It might have. can't believe you guys are still doing the birthday ritual. We started doing that. But when we were like five? We get it, Cassie. You're too cool for it now. Guys, come on. But she's clearly bummed about not being part of it. Yeah, actually. Saturday detention. Thanks a lot. They're both hurt for pretty much the yeah. same reasons as far as I could tell. Yep. Mm -hmm. That's what I meant when I said this situation is always tricky to navigate. Mm -hmm. I think this other girl with the glasses is a little bit less hurt by it. Yeah, right? I think she's a bit more caught up in the middle. She wants to be mediator, like bring them back together, I think. Yeah. You get that vibe, right? Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. Cassie made it on the billboard this time. Oh, Jesus. Oh, yep. right. So her dad's like... Cassie's family dates back to the witch trials. Oh, sorry. Or the mom. They, uh, Must be why this is Mr. Trask's favorite holiday. The descendants of that family. Right. Yes. I see. Oh, yeah. And they got you. Yes, obviously. Hey! <laughs> Mr. Trask! <laughs> and he is playing pretty much the same role he always plays these days. Fair enough. Someone's got a birthday. Are you heading to your sacred circle? We actually don't call it the sacred circle anymore. What do you call it? A secret circle? Keep the alliteration? Remember when Cassie would bring like 10 flashlights with us. <laughs> Hey, bud. Oh, God. The fuck. You right, man? Your asthma playing up? Yeah. Cracking us up, dude. Oh. Where is Cassie? Uh, well, she... Somewhere nearby. We're ostracizing her. <laughs> <laughs> She's running late. Oh. She had a, a mascara crisis. Is everything okay? Oh, no, she'll be fine. I love how he's taking that super seriously. Yeah, because he doesn't know what it is. Mm. See, so at the festival tonight, look at this. Guess who's coming back from Boston? Sandy's Candy Cauldron. Oh, yeah, right. Come on, she was the best. <laughs> and then she got so busy, she went on something called GMA, which is like some acronym for fancy people. She got well-known. Now she's coming back to the hometown. You have to have one of her caramel apples. It'll change your life. Totally. Yeah, absolutely. Good. And this guy 
apparently has just a giant boner for candy apples. Who doesn't, really? He really is the nicest man alive. Yeah. I'm kind of sad he doesn't realize Cassie kicked us to the curb. You can lie if you want, <laughs> but we all know the truth, don't we? No one can resist a good candy apple. Yeah. People of Salem, I am Gilbert the Great. Oh, uh, yeah. This guy. I do wish that there was more Halloween celebration festivals in Sydney and Australia, though. It's picking up. But it's not quite there yet. Here to terrify and amaze you with the most chilling legend of all Hallow's Eve of the Sanderson sisters. I feel like pretty much any time there's celebration festival of any kind in Sydney, it's too expensive. And I'm like, yeah, yeah, not yeah. Fan. yeah, true. You're right. Even if it did happen, it would just get outpriced immediately. Yes. <laughs> Overpriced, sorry. With the most powerful coven, thanks to Winifred's Book of Spells. <laughs> That's not to keep people from getting in. It's to keep the book from getting out. You really think they would have destroyed it? Who's the fucking cat this time? Contains the recipe to the potion used to kill Emily Binks on Halloween night, 1693. And that same night, the three witches hang. But not before they cast the curse. Enjoying that child soul. Getting a hit of that good shit. <laughs> that if a virgin should light the black flame, Sanderson sisters would one day return, take revenge on all of Salem. What's a virgin? <laughs> a person who has never should you be had a candy apple. Lit a candle. <laughs> yes, lit a candle, to to totally. Glad he realized he shouldn't be the one explaining this. Oh, absolutely. Mm. He's not ready for that lawsuit. No. 29 years ago, some swear they saw three figures fly across the moon. Sounds like someone had a little too much candy. <laughs> what kind of fucking candy are you eating? I know, man. Oh, I know what kind of candy. Uh-huh. The 90s mm. kind. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> How do you explain? The black flame candle burned. So the witches have been walking among us for 29 years. Candle's magic only brings them back for one night just can i finish this yeah actually don't heckle the performer you tool but if the candles melt then no one can light it yeah especially like the adult essentially just harassing the child performer i know right <laughs> like bro i'm smarter than a children's story <laughs> <laughs> unless there is another candle <gasps> <laughs> Black flame candles are half off for Halloween. Excellent. Nice. I've scarred this child for life. Yeah. <laughs> so, what can I get from my favorite customers? Just this. It's your birthday. You can't just come in here for one crystal like it's in the old Tuesday. Yeah, you gotta buy more shit on your yeah. birthday. That's how it works. Spend more. I was counting on this, man. I got bills to pay. <laughs> Legend has it. It's on the 16th birthday that a witch gets her powers. I'm assuming that's based in some sort of patriarchal fear of female aging. Yeah, probably that too. Sir? I have a gift for your empowerment. Just the thing for a young mystic. Ew. <laughs> a very shitty hell? looking candle. Yeah, actually. It looks like it drowned. That's a kind way to put it. I charged that candle with a very powerful magic. It's perfect for your birthday ritual. Hold, hold, hold up. What'd you put in the candle, man? Yeah, what, did you, <laughs> what are you giving to this miner? <laughs> You're looking to kill some time before your birthday plans. We're not doing the ghost tour. It's just we basically know it by heart. I'm just going to start seeing magic as a code word for drugs in this now. <laughs> it's powerful magic in it. What are these? Angelica leave. You burn them to lift curse, for you never know when you may be cursed on Halloween. Ominous. Yeah, some magic leaves. Mm -hmm. Sure. I still don't get why you chose the creepiest part of the woods to have our ritual. Kind of felt drawn to it. <sighs> it's nice to be in the comfort of nature. It really depends on what nature. I, I don't know if I would find this nature comforting. It's cool. And I love that they kept the like 80s, 90s look to yeah. it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Cool. We're gonna light a candle right near some dry leaves. Yeah. <laughs> this will go well. <laughs> really doesn't seem smart. Maybe, maybe they're probably damp. It looks like it had been raining. Felt like we needed her here with us. Regardless of where the story goes, because obviously I'm not gonna tell you, but lighting candles, lighting anything on a dry leaf bed is definitely yeah. a bad plan. I guess that just depends. Is it dry? The sitting on it must be dry. Nah, it's pretty dry. It looks dry. It looks dry. Yeah. Another, Another year begins anew. We call, call on thee with, with one request. request. Help, Help our intentions manifest. <gasps> hey. Wait, wait, wait. Cool, he put a sparkler in it. Uh, no. No, no, he didn't. <laughs> you won't go out. So did he actually remake the black flame candle? Thanks a lot, Gilbert. Yeah. Yeah. Almost started forest fire. <sighs> I mean, Hang you on. guys lit it he... on a dry bed of leaves. He didn't tell you to do that. <gasps> what the? Yeah, don't get me wrong. He's done some uncool shit here, but starting a forest fire, that's on you. Yeah. I mean, potentially. If it happens. Starting a yeah. forest fire. 
But yes, he did intentionally give you a black flame candle. Yeah. Is he? Becca? Why is everything so quiet? I don't know. We're building suspense. Are they going to pop out of the ground zombie style? I think they kind of just appear. Oh yeah, just like last time. Yeah. I feel like they don't want to go too... Oh, nope. They, oh, no. Yeah, they're coming out of the ground. There you, <laughs> you go. You go quick. <laughs> yeah. I've actually watched a surprising amount of stuff since I saw this when it came out not that long ago. Fair enough. Yeah. Brilliant. I love it. I didn't really have a problem with them just appearing last time, but this is better. Yes. The whole three, four crack in the ground. Yeah. I guess they're coming straight out of hell. Are you still here? Yes. Wasn't there a moon? <laughs> yeah, hang on. What's going on? Did they black out the moon briefly? What's I guess the deal? so. <laughs> 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 yes, Salem, we're back! The reunion tour. <laughs> Are those the Sanderson sisters? Running wild and so reviled. Uh, of course, there's a musical number. <laughs> Times are changing because the witches are back. Oh my god. Literally can't stop watching that. <laughs> I appreciate that they address it. That's so great! Yeah. Don't tell me neither. How is this happening? Candle, virgin. Yeah. Yeah, actually. Did Gilbert just guess that they were virgins? Yes. The witches are back! I hope he didn't, like, do any... I hope he didn't ask. That would have been weird. Who are they performing for? You! Yeah, try to find out in pretty yeah. much any way. Yeah, I mean, any way whatsoever. Yeah. How convenient are two little mortals ripe for picking. Brew the life potion. Steal their soul. And give as much exposition as possible. Boy! Gotta make sure we have time to make all of this work. This movie is allowed to do all of it, though. It gets a complete free pass to be as cheesy as it wants. Well, yeah, it's kind of the point. Yeah. Well, where is this picking up light? So do you, like, not remember any spells, or...? I guess she needs to have the book physically as well. Where was he last seen? We were in the cottage, the boys were in the cages, <gasps> and that's when that sunrise <gasps> tricked us, fake sunrise. <gasps> yeah, did those two dudes just die, starved to death in the cages? <laughs> you know, I don't think we get an explanation. That's brilliant. So... I love that. Last time there will be no trickery. This time you see a teenager, we will kill it! <gasps> I'm gonna say yes. <laughs> nice. Or better yet, they're still there, somehow surviving in the those cages. Oh, Wait, we're not teenagers. Really, we're 40? 40? Ooh, 40. Dudes, come on. <laughs> oh, <Old> folks. Fine <laughs> physician. <laughs> They're aged. <laughs> yeah, I mean, we eat young souls all the time. Totally. That's why we brought you back. You are our idols. Idols? <laughs> yeah, clever. Thou dost worship us? Of course. Totally. Huge fangirls. Which one do you like the best? Yeah, I think that was probably one of the only things that would have worked in the situation. Yeah. And great news. You don't even have to brew the potion anymore you could just buy them <gasps> buy them yeah that's right we have a whole youth and beauty industry <laughs> You're gonna take them to Lush? <laughs> Something like that, yeah. Shops where you can go buy all sorts of serums and lotions. Oh, oh lotions? Like potions. Take them to Sephora? Yeah, they take them to Walgreens. Just like potions, except better because the soul's are already mixed in. <gasps> Which, okay, we don't have Walgreens. Right. But it's like, no more luring children to their demise? It's like a very common pharmacy. Yeah, right. I think in America, at least I've seen a lot of them in the places that I've been at. It feels like an ad when it comes up, the scene of them in Walgreens. Okay, oh, so they actually take them there now. They actually go to Walgreens. Okay, fair enough. They're already demised. Oh, that's a great time hack. Thank you kindly. <laughs> <laughs> the luring. Twas my only job. Oh, no. Just as let us confabulate. Oh, confabulate, confabulate. She's been made redundant. Don't worry, you'll find new purpose, I'm mm. sure. This changing industry is <laughs> not kind to, you know, our older citizens. Lead us! To buy an apothecary. Toot sweet. Toot sweet. Toot sweet, sure. It is powerful indeed. Observe, yes. sisters, it glows from within. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's fluorescence for you. I mean, they saw lights in the last movie. Mm. Fluorescence? Yes. You know, I think we knew her. <laughs> fluorescence. Such a lot. <laughs> the gates, they parted for her. She must be very powerful. Yeah. Well, so am I. They really are just... 
killing it. <laughs> mm-hmm. Kind of feels like uh, no time has passed. You know? Actually. Yeah. Except for the much better cameras. Yes. <laughs> okay, I'll give it a try. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Why? She got scared, right? Yeah. <laughs> she gets gassy when she's scared. This doesn't look a thing like Baba's apothecary. So, children's souls. Children's oh, yes. souls. Aisle four. I'll I'll play the alive where are the potions. Just fucking point them. You look at the numbers in the sky. There you go. Oh, the no, you fools! <laughs> they beckon me. You wasn't wrong. That's not the sky. That's just off the ceiling. Oh God, yes. We're right behind you. Look for anything that says you. Okay, let's get out here. Move. Oh, oh shit. Jesus. I love that it works every time. <laughs> <laughs> where are you two delicious morsels going? What do you mean? Anywhere else? No, 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 not running away. Giving you some space. Oh no. I don't like space. Friends, let's get closer. <laughs> let's not. Yeah. Just in case I decide to eat you. <laughs> Soup's on. <laughs> Shall we? She's just kidding around, pals. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh no. Oh god. Blood all over the woodsy place. <laughs> yeah, they they would like it. His that means it's working. Ah. Well, yeah, I mean, they're used to drinking potions, right? Yeah. So. <laughs> oh, oh, God. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, no. Oh. oh, ew. We should get some salt so we taste better when they eat us. Exactly. Yeah, I'm being considerate. This is protects against dark magic. That's what Gilbert says to get people to buy it. It could be true. I mean, didn't Gilbert screw you over? Are you the Sanderson sisters? But oh. it is true in other, you know, yes. witch stuff. We're obsessed with those looks. Clearly. Can we take a photo? Photo. <laughs> photo. Oh. <laughs> I love that they were like, I don't know what that is. Ah. <laughs> 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 Oh, yeah, and because they don't understand what a filter is, they're like, hey, we, oh, we wow. look young and beautiful. Nice. The lotions work. Why are these children dressed like us? They also worship you. Uh oh, really? <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> the illusion has been undone. How many children's souls are in those potions? How many souls? He's like, please don't ask <laughs> about our production ethics. <laughs> Teenager. No, no, he, he's just confused. Don't listen to him. It's just bad life. <laughs> That's not good. Okay, okay, okay. I love how she's just fucking stocking up. I know it's like salt or whatever. But... And curse things! Yeah! I feel like there's snacks there too. I didn't know what to grab. I just grabbed everything. I don't blame her for stress eating a little bit. Hey, <laughs> hell, does Satan bomb it. It's a high pressure situation. Yeah. Oh, nice. Yeah. Salt can do that? It totally can, apparently. Holy Lucifer! Wow. How did she do that? Holy Lucifer. <laughs> Need my book. We must brew the life book. potion. Fate will be sealed at sunrise! It makes you wonder, have they never come across salt before? Yeah, guess not. Can I take another minute? You wanna hit me? Uh -oh. yeah. when you... <laughs> you wanna hit me? We already drank the life potion! <laughs> Those were a hoax! Really not keeping up with things, huh? Yeah. He must fly. Fly. On what? It's a good thing she's got sisters. Just like my own one. What about us? There's only one? Don't worry. There are other good options. Find something, anything. We must fly! Better options. I think I remember this from the promo. Yep. Oh. Yeah. That's so brilliant. Yes. Cowabunga! <laughs> <laughs> she remembers that one. When I'm holy dance off, I'll do it. Oh, that's so good. <laughs> the man said, be careful, they have a mind of their own. I'm pretty sure she like brought them to life. Yes. So. Cursed them. We must fly to our ancestral cottage, get book, and brew our potion. We run amok in Salem. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Stop that. God, stop singing that. <laughs> Don't make me come over there with this brew. This jackass. Yeah. Yo, Bert, where did you get that candle? Ah! The, 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 the book is alive. He woke up? You're surprised by that? <gasps> hey, buddy. <laughs> uh, yeah, he's in on it. You guys know each other? He's a big fanboy. I see. Remember me? Yeah, it's Gilbert. Gilbert the Great. I mean, why do you think he runs this fucking store? I, I, I've earned the title now with my knowledge of magical and the occult. He's not from the last movie or anything, is he? No. Well, okay. it's so incredible. I can't believe it. Sort of. Okay, we'll see. <laughs> Probably shouldn't have let him do that. Yeah, not a great plan. I can't believe it worked! Shut up! What do you 
mean it worked? Oh, did they sing? They did. You knew that was a black flame candle? Look, sorry, I had to trick you, like, but... Come on, man. I couldn't light the candle myself. It wouldn't have worked. Well, why not? Dude. Oh, Ew! <laughs> He's a growing ass yeah, man. Yeah, an adult that's had sex. Ew! They're evil! Well, only because they had to be. They were misunderstood. Um, are you sure? I mean... Look, everybody loves them! Look at all this stuff! The eating children part. Maybe he thought that was like a metaphor or something. I don't think so. <laughs> they don't really know what that would be a metaphor for. Yeah. <laughs> Back to our sperm in a subbode. Where are all the cobwebs? My rat tails. Yeah. Oh no, the rat tails. My collection. <laughs> it no longer smells like death. <laughs> now it smells like... Uh... Clean linen. <laughs> yeah, we have a plug-in for that. <laughs> what? what? I'm Gilbert the Great, and I am your biggest fan. You can't just call yourself that, man. People do think they can do that. They yeah. think they can all they want, but Whatever. doesn't mean they should. Mm. Oh, I miss me. I found the two 40 year old teenagers. <laughs> <laughs> the 40 year old virgins. Yeah. Can we kill them now? All in good time. Throw them in that dungeon. Is it still a dungeon? Is it a storage? Yeah, is it just. Oh. Oh, he didn't know that was no. there. I'm guessing. That's just a basement. Can we talk about this? No. Did he seriously think they were just like misunderstood? Yes. None shall see or hear thee shout. There's no way out. Uh, I think you'll see why too. I thought he meant misunderstood, but like he's crazy, you know? <laughs> oh, wow. Good one. <laughs> Misguided is the word I would use. I see. Yeah. Whatever those two may have done, I'm sure it's just a misunderstanding. Yeah, I thought that he was like a condoning child murder kind of thing. What are we going to do? I don't know. I don't know. Um, window, window, window. window. Yeah. Something like, no, but like, they had to kill the children for the greatness of their vision or some shit like that, you know? Or maybe just that's just clear. the one thing he's totally fine with. Yeah, fair <laughs> enough. He's like, man, kids suck. And, and everything fucking else performance with them every Every damn mm. year. Like, There's shit every time. <laughs> he's one of those guys who's like just totally clean cut and nice and everything is perfect except for the children. He's like, no, you can eat children. Yeah, I've been trying to bring you back ever since I saw you that night. Ah. Yeah. What night? He was one of the little kids. Yeah. Halloween, 1993. Yeah. Not a great year for me. You can see they just filmed this after the fact, like recently. Oh, for sure. So yes. He wasn't really in the last movie, you know no. what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw you. I chased you all the way to the cemetery. What? Bye bye. So he didn't really get any of the actual story. He just saw them flying and singing and I shit. See, I see. Yeah. He yeah. just saw witches. Yeah. So I, you know, I wanted to know for sure. So I went to see if the candle was lit. I found a book. But he knew about the thing with the youngest pink sister. So what the fuck? He was awake. He showed me how to make another candle. It wasn't pretty. But... Oh, my beloved. And he was like, and I talked to a satanic book. So, you know, I had no indication you guys would be bad news. <laughs> it's time to conjure together once more. Uh, what are we conjuring exactly? Something fun. Maybe. Silence! <laughs> Definitely not something fun. Well, I mean, fun for them. Fun for them, for sure. Tis the reverend. Yeah. <laughs> sort of. He's alive. The reverend's... Of course not, you ninny. Great, 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 whatever. Yeah, he lives on through him. Yeah. Must be a descendant. Who is this man? Of best the mayor. Three hundred years later, a cloud of trash still looms over Salem. Some of them families just fucking never go away. True. See, we should have uh, the entire family when we had the chance. Mother said witches would rule Salem. What have we done instead? She was right there. Should have killed him. Die? <laughs> <laughs> and yes. Oh, come back. Come back to mother. All they did was die twice. Yeah. Well, Perhaps maybe like a, a calming circle. I don't know about that. I read Reverend Trask's journals. All nice things, I hope. Not really. No. 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 Wait, so then... I know, right? Why did you want to bring them back? Um, I guess he figured Trask is like a bit of a blowhard. Yes, and that he's got a massive bias and that yeah. he was a religious zealot and everything. So yes, I yeah. get that part. But even so, you knew about the murder. <laughs> you, oh, I guess maybe he thought just history was inaccurate. All I can think of here. <laughs> Again, child soul eating is totally on the table. It's okay. It's on the menu. It's per fine. Se. It's morally acceptable. <laughs> to him, yes. All right. Yeah. Fair enough. But maybe we could make a life potion? I'm done with piddling potions. We were the most powerful witches on earth. Nothing can stop us. We are doing the power spell. Okay. We're going yeah. super sane. That's right. You promised you'd never do that spell. That promise has expired. <laughs> oh, okay. So there's a statute of limitations on promises. Yeah, I was like, is that how that works? Good to know. Oh, that's right. Book doesn't like it, though. Yeah. You got it. 
Poke him in the eye. Don't think that'll help. I don't think he cares for that spell. The book has opinions? Yes. Yes. Those your teeth. They're your calling card. I like the book. <laughs> They're your calling card. <laughs> what is happening? Yeah, book, book really is... does uh, have autonomy. He could leave if he wants to. He just doesn't want to most of the time. Tell me the power spell. <laughs> No, mean. Yeah, that seems kind of abusive. Beware the power spell. Why, we have no time for warning. <laughs> Book has been nothing but good to you. The incantation has to be recited seven times. You could say he's been a woman's best friend. Yes. <laughs> Knowledge really is power. Mm -hmm. Be done in a sacred place. Oh, we are not oh, allowed in. Not one of their sacred places, you nitpick. Does it specify what kind of sacred? A forbidden wood. <gasps> You could go to a stadium that's sacred to sports fans. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Place of worship. Yeah. It's sacred? The head of a lover. It's all of our lovers are... <sighs> but we could buy new ones. Ooh, Sarah's just on her game, man. Dig up my old lover, Billy Butcherson. And there you go. <laughs> Billy was my lover. Yeah. Sarah, you were just a play. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's the other way around. Yeah. <laughs> One petrified spider. Oh, my enemy's blood. Yeah, he did seem to be a bit keener on Sarah. Yeah. That reminds me, Gilbert, dost thou have the Sanderson hourglass? Um, no. Definitely not. No. Actually, no, I don't I don't think I do. Well, from his reaction here, you're getting the Ooh. impression that he's immediately like, oh shit, I've made a mistake. Yes. If you don't have it, we'll just have to kill thee. So it's like, which which thing did you misunderstand? Yeah, I know, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, you said hourglass. No, I, that I do have, actually, yeah. <gasps> the pink boy. Oh yeah, no, that, that's just a cat. Uh, that's just Cobweb, he's my cat. Oh, Cobweb. It's really the Zachary. <laughs> Don't kill him! Break, kill a cat. I have your hourglass. My life depends upon this task. Let's call it a binding contract. Oh, crap. Shall gather yeah. all the ingredients and bring them to the Forbidden Wood. We shall sniff out the blood of our enemy. Maybe don't enter into a contract with witches. I don't think he had a choice. <laughs> and if you fail, you forfeit your life with the last grain of this sand. That looks like it's running very quickly. Yeah. I had to keep that hourglass, didn't you? Wait here while I go to find that wretched dress. I think it's more of a, oh, you just had to make that black candle, didn't you? Yeah. <laughs> Be sure to come to me when I call. Totally. The mayor's blood awaits. I like considering Book can float, they could have just... You know, run them along. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, they're gonna kill Mr. Trash. They're gonna kill everybody. An invincible, vengeful maniac obsessed with getting revenge on Salem sounds very bad. We have to tell Cassie. That's how we get her in the story. Back in the story. Or in this part of the story. Yeah, yes. yeah. Becca? Involved in the main plot. And she's briefly happy to hear from her friends. The Sanderson sisters are back and they're coming after your dad. I think you might be covering your camera. I can't see you. She can't hear us. Step outside. It's about dial. Listen. <sighs> yeah. Why would you? Mm. <laughs> There's no way out of here. Yes, there is. There's many ways out of here. Angelica leaves. They lift curses. The salt worked. If candles mm -hmm. can bring back the dead, why can't potpourri bring back the stairs? <laughs> and again, the salt with the deflecting of the magic. Yeah. I'm gonna dig up a whole grave in time. Poor Billy. Just can't catch a fucking break. Yeah. That's not six feet under. Dude just wants to be dead. <laughs> yeah, I mean, they buried him pretty shallow, I guess. Who are you? I mean, wasn't it just the kids from the last movie who buried him anyway? Yeah, that's right. Well, he kind of just jumped back into the ground. Assuming they covered him up. Zombie! Stop! I am a good zombie! Yeah. Don't try to eat my brains. He doesn't want to. I simply wish to know why you were digging up my grave. I simply wish to know why you're alive. He's not. He's undead. Well, I've been awake since... How long ago was 1993? Seriously, oh. he's been awake the whole time. Oh, right, yeah. Were you there that night with the Sanderson sisters? He was. Unfortunately. Wow. Poor bastard. I thought I had trouble getting to sleep. <laughs> They're back. Yeah. <laughs> no, wait! No, fuck this. <laughs> I was just like, out. I'm getting back in my hole. I need your help. Uh, I'm doing a spell to kill Winifred. Don't you want to pay her back for poisoning you and throwing your mouth shut? Well, thou knoweth how I die. Everyone knoweth. You say everyone, but come on. I knoweth many things. <laughs> you were Winifred's lover, and you cheat on her with Sarah, so she killed you. That is not what happened. <laughs> Clever. Yep. I shared one kiss with Winifred. She has sullied my name. Literally just the fact that people know that you kissed her or whatever. <laughs> the misinformation. Yeah. <laughs> if you help me gather everything I need for the spell, I will tell everyone the truth about you. Oh. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, trust. 
Yeah, unsurprising. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Saw that coming. Yeah. There we go. Perfect. <laughs> Never gets old, though. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Does make you wonder, where are the other two... I'm looking for the mayor. I want to say other two brooms, so the rumors aren't brooms, but you know what I mean. Yeah. The other two rides. Uh, in storage. Yeah. Have you had these before? Oh, get ready. <laughs> this guy's way too keen for these candy apples. Dude, he's about to cream over those candy oh, apples. Oh, yeah. He's going to candy his apples. <laughs> Look at, they're drowning a man. Jesus It's Christ. a weird game, bobbing for apples. It looks like he is being drowned. Mm. Darling, I like this festival. But nope, that's how the game works. Really? Someone has to push you in? Apparently. What the fuck? Perhaps they're going to roast him on a spit. Yeah, I don't get that. There they are. <laughs> they're grabbing a snack. Yep. They just burned the whole place down. <laughs> <laughs> now what? Cool. Poison apple. She's like, bitch, you what? You know, obviously she does want a poisoned apple. Thou must yeah. never announce that they are poison sister. <laughs> She's gonna give advice. You fucking amateur. <laughs> amateur. This bitch. <laughs> <laughs> that looks scrumptious. No, he's like, like, until we find the man. Why not? I give. I'm tired, Winnie. I need like snack and a stool. Well, yeah, she is the only one standing through this whole trip. True. Who would be stupid enough to need three witches to the mayor? Cassie, open up! <laughs> nice cut. Brilliant. Crazy witches are trying to kill your dad. Yeah, they're not. Good. She's not gonna listen to you. What are you guys doing, dad? Grounded me for the rest yeah. of my life because you ratted me out. She's a bit pissed. <laughs> he went back to the festival to get his apple. Obviously, you know there's nothing more important than that apple. Mike. Hey, buddy. What the hell? Oh. Because <laughs> me and luck we stumbled upon the village idiot. Yes. That's fair. It, it is. Very lucky. Who looks my but inside now? Oh, my God. Maybe leave the door open long enough for Mike. No. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, fuck Mike. <laughs> you saw them flying right, so we don't need to explain that to you. That's what the dad was afraid of. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. What is happening? They really don't make doors like they used to, huh? Mike just sold them out, so, you know. <laughs> Spread out. <laughs> Shouldn't feel too bad about it. I don't think he was trying to. <laughs> <laughs> too bad. <laughs> Do better, Mike. <laughs> Stop spreading out. Not like that. Oh. Oh. She's just doing what she was told. Sorry, I didn't catch that. <gasps> oh, right, okay. I'm sure it's also product placement, but yeah. that's pretty funny. Mm. There is a small woman trapped in that. Box. Is there something else I can do for you? Yeah. <laughs> what? Okay. No, he got it in the oh, end. He did get it. There you go. Oh, but they're oh. all coming for him. What do you? What's the bet? You're in a flash mob. Oh. How, how much of that apple do you think he's gonna eat? Nothing. He's gonna drop it. I think someone steals it. You guys should get an apple. Whoa, 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 whoa! Who's got my apple? I like to think that it wasn't even one of the bewitched people. Yeah. Someone just robbed him. So we just took the opportunity to lean in and steal his apple. Yeah. <laughs> They're like, oh, excellent. He's distracted and they're sold out. Yeah. <laughs> We're going to win us a spider. Yes, we are. Not petrified. That's really how we she won't know the difference. <laughs> I'm pretty sure she will. It's kind you of think. their thing. Well, I mean, they've been pretty uh, unaware so far. You know, you, I, 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 you can do this. Kind of believe in yourself. Believe in yourself. Ah! Yeah, I think he believes in himself just yeah, fine. He's good. All in the legs. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Yeah, the uh, atrophied, falling <laughs> necrotic apart legs. legs. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I smell children. Ew. At least it's not Teen Spirit. <laughs> oh, what's her name again? Uh, Nothing worse it, than that smell. It looks all dingy. It's got the same lighting as the music video too. <laughs> the old Jenna to do just yeah, turns yeah. up. Uh, it's Becca. <laughs> Goodbye, Becca. You need the juice of an Aurelia berry for your spell, right? This is all the Aurelia juice in Salem. Let me out of here alive, yep. or I will pour it out. That near empty bottle of crushed water. Hey. Oh, seriously, gullible. <laughs> yeah. Does Aurelia juice look like water? I don't actually know. Yeah. I'm, I just figure it wouldn't look exactly like water. Yeah. What has Salem ever done for me? No one in Salem has ever tried to kill my friends. Is that attractive to hold a grudge? You say that, but I disagree. <laughs> You've literally held a grudge for centuries. But look how good. <laughs> <laughs> that tyrannical task tried to take my sister's now. No, give no, me that Aurelia juice. Now. now! Yes, now. Now. Salt them. There you go. They've been assaulted. Oh, dude. Kill him, Winnie. 
I do appreciate that they don't understand how the salt works. <laughs> yeah, I feel like it would be the only advantage they would have yeah. if they did. <laughs> well, that and the ridiculous lack of using their brains. Yes. I was going to say their lack of brain power, but they're not stupid. No. They just miss stuff. Yes. The salt blocks dark magic. You're basically dark magic in human form. You're trapped. <gasps> impossible. Yeah, totally. Totally impossible. Yeah. Man, those shoes work. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you test. No, you don't need to test twice. Well, I guess you do. Whatever. She wants to, though. <laughs> oh, this? Oh, no, this is just water. Yeah, I mean... You've been tricked by teenagers. Obviously. Again. Yeah, yeah, not the first time. This keeps happening to you. Let us bewitch them with song. Lure them to setting us free. <laughs> yeah, sure, totally. Give it a go. I'm a here down there. <laughs> just leave. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't feel particularly warmed up. They're trying to figure out their harmony. <laughs> That's so good. No one I was going to be down there, I might have... Stop it! Do not tell people we wish to be witch. That we are about to bewitch them! Yeah. Generally a good thought process, you know. If you want to trick someone... I mean, I don't want them to have it, but <laughs> yeah. Oh, buddy. <laughs> uh, worth a try. Yeah, good effort. She cursed you! You are helping yeah. them! I know that bullshit. <laughs> 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 No! How could you betray me like this, yeah. Gilbert? <laughs> Thought we had something, man. <laughs> I need your head! Take one of their heads! Huh? I don't think that would count. You were her lover! Ugh, we shared one kiss! Yeah, so does he even count? Let me explain. I guess so. You know what I mean? <laughs> Dude, just give me some head. Yeah, people <laughs> get so weirded out. Like, guys, can you please take this home? Like, <laughs> follow the sound of my voice, you dustbag. There are kids out here. You can't just say shit like that. <laughs> people walk by and say, oh, no, no. I'm just trying to get some Look, head. I just want his head. <laughs> it's the best one. I'm going to go ahead and inference. You're the one responsible for the Sanderson sisters being alive. This is why you shouldn't mess around with that witchery. Don't think she did it on purpose. Oh, yeah. No, yeah, she did. I mean, kind of. no, she was bamboozled. Gilbert tricked us into lighting the candle. Gilbert did this? Yeah. Tricked into lighting the candle, yes, but not tricked yeah. into witchery. They've oh, been doing yeah, that no, every no, year. For... That stuff does, does, does <laughs> different. You the know. thing he literally said. Yeah. Uh... I mean, yeah, I mean, you know, there should be a distinction there, <laughs> all right? It's been kind of a crazy night. You would know if you'd have been there. I didn't exactly feel welcome, you know, because you guys iced me out. You ditched us. What are you talking about? So they obviously yeah. think the same thing about each other. I kept asking you guys to hang out and you would just not respond. Everything you wanted to do involved Mike and his friends. And we couldn't hang out with you without having to hang out with- Yeah, difficult situations. You didn't tell me. Why would we want to hang out with people that just make fun of us? Oh. You call us witches and say that we're weird. Because you hang out in magic stores and I think it's weird. I don't make fun of you guys. He literally doesn't know uh, he's been bullied. Oh them. man. Pointing out people's differences and saying that they're weird is making fun of them. You didn't have to crack me up. The Pause. look on his face. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I hate it that I've met this person before. Yeah. That this is a thing. Oh, like, yeah. I'm not making fun of you. I'm just pointing out that that's weird. And then I realize that's like normal and weird are completely subjective terms. Mm. Like that's just trying to make someone feel like they're wrong or out of place is bullying. And they're just like, no, but I wasn't doing that. And it's like, yeah, you are. <laughs> yeah, this is why I'm careful when it's like, if I'm calling myself a weirdo or people like me are a weirdo, that's not a negative thing. But I understand yeah, yeah. that if I say that about other people, it may not be viewed that way. Yeah, no, it just depends on vernacular. It depends what kind of groups you've been rolling as well yeah totally and how much it's been used as either a compliment or a detriment mm -hmm. <laughs> i appreciate yeah. how they laid this out it feels very believable absolutely you know whoa did you really not know that yes he did not know i thought i was just making conversation he thought he was being friendly <laughs> wait 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 i've got so many people to apologize to. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. oh my god dad Woo! Did you okay. see that look on his face like, I, oh shit. I appreciate that he was actually just that dense. <laughs> yeah. He's actually not a bad guy at all. Oh. Well, I'm not trying to be. Oh, the sun. Oh, no. no one was really the bad guy in that situation. It really was just a misunderstanding. Yeah. My mistake. It's just a very small bus. And that does happen. And uh, hurt feelings getting in the way of communication. Oh, a lot of things getting in the way of communication. Yes. Oh. <laughs> Ew. Imagine being Cassie's dad right now, just like, <laughs> what the fuck are you guys doing here? Yeah, didn't I just fix this shit? It's an older crowd than I expected. Sanderson sisters, right? You guys look amazing. Where are the kids? Weren't they just down the road? Yeah, they're nearby. Okay, we're giving a performance now. <laughs> <laughs> I love the resting witch face. <laughs> Love that. I could play the reverend, you know. I hate the Sanderson sisters. 
Ah, that wasn't that great. That was pretty fucking good, man. You could say it's in your blood. <laughs> I'm the mayor. Ah! Please, it's dead! Okay, cool. Another little trash. Don't trust them. Yeah. These weird women broke into your house. Yeah. <laughs> Call the police. Who are these women? Criminals. Seriously. What's going on? Three poor women with serious delusions. Finally have the blood of a man in our nostrils. We are trapped in salt like a slab of corned beef. <laughs> <laughs> Trapped in soul. Stop, 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 stop. I have had an awful day. Do you know that? Unchaperoned house party you were throwing in there. The gothic golden girls in my garage. That was your version of an awful day. I know, right? At least you got your caramel apple, right? I mean, he was pretty stoked on that candy apple. It's a candy apple, <laughs> though? Yeah. He might need to reorganize his priorities. But <laughs> after mine was stolen, I went back and Sandy had given away all her apples, which I think is really unprofessional. I'm sorry, what? So then I went to some Walgreens who turned out their lights. Being out of stock is not unprofessional. It's I being know. good at business. It makes no sense. This sounds pretty on point for customer mm -hmm. service, though. But you know what I got in the dark? <laughs> this pathetic thing. It's still a candy apple. This is probably a caramel covered matzo ball. I'm going to eat it and I'm going to like what it. What the fuck? Calm down, man. It doesn't sound like you will. <laughs> I feel bad. He's been talking about that caramel apple for weeks. Weeks? Yeah. My God. He really doesn't seem like he's got a lot going for him. Yeah. It's supposed to be a very quiet town. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the mayor is uh, that unbusy. No! I cannot. My eyes are misted over. Well, unmist and look at the help that's coming your way. Yeah. Do you see this? Oh. It'll work. I yeah. was wondering how they were going to get out of it, actually. <laughs> for real. They like to eat dirt and stuff. Yeah. They don't like go. mess. Is your dad mad? Barry, he wants everyone to leave. He didn't even know you guys were here. Oh, no. Well, we can hang out here. Watch out for the Sanderson sisters until sunrise. I'll tell my mom we're sleeping over at Cassie's. She misses you. Susan. <laughs> you. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Yoink. <laughs> oh. Ah, there you go. Starting to notice some shit, huh? What was that? I, I don't know. We gotta get Cassie. Some static shocks shit going on. Oh, man. I just wanted to bust out the manhole cover. Yeah. Oh. oh. Shit. How did you get this far? <laughs> The body is surprisingly autonomous. Yeah. Despite not knowing where it's going. Head of a lover, witch's butter, Aurelia berry juice, petrified spider. It's not a spider, it's not petrified. It's definitely, yeah. So you don't have the head of a lover and you don't have a petrified spider. Yeah. Don't you think those technicalities matter? I'm not gonna die. Oh, they're still gonna kill you. How do I kill them first? Oh, now you decide to kill them. Oh, buddy, you gonna <laughs> try and put it out? It won't go out until the sun rises, you. Adult. No need for name calling. I mean, he's Felt appropriate. He's a bit pissed. Mm. Very understandable. Impeccable timing. He didn't just arrive, you did. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> Hello, withering hag. Well, if thou has nothing nice to say. I do appreciate that we have his, him talking the whole time this time. Yeah. Uh, and there we now. go. <laughs> now we have everything we need. No. Boy. Touch bum, there's no talking cat this time. Uh, you, you said you need the blood of an enemy. I feel like it would be a little too much on the yeah. nose. I hear your point, though. Yeah. But, I mean, sh she's not your enemy. That's our enemy's blood. Ooh, uh, Ow. Uh, yeah. Looks like you've got every everything you need, so maybe let her go, okay? How would we torture her? Huh? Yeah, how are they going to eat her soul if they let her go? Yeah. This isn't historically accurate witches. No. This is movie witches. Mm. So they're actually monsters. <laughs> I swear they just zapped him in the nuts. Yeah. Should we? No. Cassie. That's the only thing that would make him get that much airtime. <laughs> Reveal the incantation. I call upon this sacred land. So now Book is all cool with doing the spell. Apparently. I sacrifice my love tonight. Magica Maxima. Give to me. So hold up. Did you just skip over the line where you just said, I sacrifice my love? I guess to love her. Billy's head. Oh, that's what they think. Yeah. <laughs> oh. I think we just got to give that one a pass. <laughs> See the... Becca. Winifred, do you love him? Yeah. Do you love anything It doesn't say other head than of yourself? a lover. It says sacrifice your love. It's not the same thing. The stall in the Walgreens, the leaves in the basement, Cassie's house. Yep. You're a witch. Yeah. It doesn't make any sense. You're a witch, Becca. <laughs> I'm a what? <laughs> do you think we can use your magic to stop them and save Cassie? I don't think that's how magic works. Nah, no, fuck it. <laughs> the plot is on our side. <laughs> I guess we're going to find out. I love how she's like, no, I don't think I can do that. No. No. <laughs> Let's just go die. <laughs> yeah. A witch? Oh. <laughs> this little witch against the most powerful coven in history. I like that it was just a little spark at first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> She's figuring it out. Ow! Hey! 
got our own coven, you witch. Sort of. I mean, as much a coven as the other two sisters. <laughs> <laughs> well, look, I, see, I'm pretty sure these other two sisters actually do have magic. They've shown examples. I mean, they I, can think, fly. I still think they get it from Winnie. Maybe. That's possible. <gasps> Oh. Yeah, they're just figuring out That's they can new. shoot lightning too. I am suddenly powerful. Unlimited power! <laughs> Give me power! I mean, I can judge, but my reaction would be exactly the same. Oh yeah, I would be making like finger guns and shit. Yeah, for sure. I'm dancing around like an idiot. Get them! Get them! <laughs> 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 I am not a fool. Well, I I'm, mean... I am a good, loyal sister. I expect to be seen as such! Those things don't cancel each other out, though. I think she's all of those things. Yeah. You know? Shut up and get going! Of course, Winnie. She is a good, <laughs> good and loyal sister, but she's also still a fool. Yeah. <laughs> don't get up. You don't want to do the spell. You have a choice. And what choice would that be? I'm talking to the book. Ah, oh. nice. Because I was going to say, what's the choice? Just eat more children. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He didn't like your, your crazy spell. Book? No! He was never binded to her. He mm. chose yeah. to spend his time with her. It was, yeah, it was given. <gasps> <laughs> oh, not even the given part. You could choose at any point. At any oh, point yeah. To yeah, true, true. It's always had autonomy. Yeah, he's decided to be with her. I am so sorry. I should have just no, so you. Sorry. The I... implication I got from the first movie was that it was given to them by Satan, though. I'm so happy this is happening right now, but can we please figure out a plan? Well, it was given to them by a more powerful witch. Yeah. She could have been Satan. Yeah, sure. Is there anything that we can do? I would make the book implicitly evil. <laughs> Magic High Maxima. I don't want to be all powerful. I think it wants you to read the warning. Yeah. Oh, the book is alive, by the way. Yeah, just so you know. In case the flying autonomy and I didn't give it away. Yeah. Beware the power spell, for it is most dangerous. Power is meant to be shared. Claim it all, a price must be paid. What is valued most dearly, thou shall have to trade. Yeah, honestly, it's in the main spell already. What does she value most? Yeah. Sacrifice Herself. your love. What does she love? <laughs> She has a new parlor trick. If what she's been doing is parlor tricks, then what is the shit that you were doing? I know, right? She's done a hell of a lot more impressive stuff than you have so far. <laughs> and she's just getting started. <laughs> Holding her own pretty admirably. Yeah, against three witches. Power is meant to be shared. That's right. Every ending is Guardians of the Galaxy now. Of course. <laughs> Becca, give me your hand. Kind of in the middle of something right now. Power is meant to be shared. Share, motherfucker. Come on. <laughs> you have to play nice with the other witches. Come on. Yay, the power of three. Even with your sisters as powerful as you are, you still can't win. My spell. Maybe it's not. Parasite, mm -hmm. leeches enjoying the spoil. Is actually that what you think? Yes. I remain the most powerful one. Couldn't even finish the power spell. We have your book. I do not need a book. <gasps> Heartbroken. We will complete the spell without book. Your inconsequential powers will not protect you or your little friends. You haven't proven so far that you're good at doing spells without book. Yeah. <sighs> uh, very distinctly needed him every single time. Do we just do magic? Aside from just like, you know, a bit of bit of lightning. Yeah, the old finger guns. <laughs> yeah. Pew pew. <laughs> <laughs> the Palpatine special. The warning. I think I know how to stop them. We have to tell them. It's time. Huh? It's time. I guess they only need to remember the last little bit to finish this up, so. Guess so. She's got a good memory. I call upon this sacred land. Love how the spell still worked even with a toy spider. Yeah, I know, right? That seems like way more bullshit than Billy's head to me. It's the most <laughs> obvious one. Yeah. I sacrifice my love tonight. There you go. Give for me! If you even got the purple go thing going on. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> Told you, man. Everything is Guardians now. It is. It is all Guardians of the Galaxy. <laughs> the magic beam of light into yeah. the sky, though. Yeah, the sky beam. Not just... Can't have a finale without a sky beam. How many movies have the sky beam now? I don't even a know lot. where it started. A, a lot. The flame is out, and yet we are still... Still here. Is it the sisters? The sisters of the sacrifice? You want me to tell you or want to find out? I'll find out. All I right. just want record if I guessed it. Smart play. Always keep a record. And all sailors shall Delete it if I get it wrong. <laughs> <laughs> 
fucking destroying houses left, right, and so actually unleashing chaos. Hey, that's what they love. Oh no, it turns out the main thing they can't do is just witchery because that's what they love. All oh, right. <laughs> yeah. Just, just imagine. Yeah. Yes, yeah. Well, well, well. The little witch returns with her luckies. Hypocrite. Yeah, no, right. You should have read the warning. I read none. You read none of the warnings? <laughs> Come on, man. For real? It takes what you value most. Silence. Seriously? Oh, nothing but a silly child. Oh, uh, yeah. Winnie? Yeah. But she Here read we go the again. fine print, though. Yeah. <laughs> One thing about silly children in this day and age, yeah, people no. know to read the fine print. Yeah. Or at least that they should. <laughs> mm. Stealing my fingers? Those damn fucking terms and conditions will get you every time. <gasps> yeah. Sisters. <laughs> But yeah, so obviously you were right. Yeah. Please don't forget us. I was wondering if they were going to go for the actual, like, she loves them that much. Yeah. Well, I was trying to hint, but not tell you. Yeah, yeah. I know I was a favorite. <gasps> Stop, Woody. With a ghost now. To hell, I think. <laughs> yeah, I would assume. Don't leave me. And not for the witchcraft, for the, like, eating children's souls. Are you not coming <laughs> with us? Regardless of how you eat yeah. souls, it's probably not a good I'm thing. Just, I'm just not okay with that. <laughs> it's very problematic. <laughs> Speaking of, no soul eating, guys. Yeah. Please. Sorrow is such sweet parting. I do yeah. love Kathy Najimy's outro there. Parting is such sweet sorrow. Oh, yeah, Such yeah. a nice line. <laughs> For this kind of movie. Rescind the spell. Bit late. <laughs> yeah. Undo what I have done. I beg of you. Maybe you could have been begging before they were completely disintegrated. They were the price you paid. Well, yeah, what did you think sacrificing my, your love meant? My beloved Fionnade sisters, I they were my kin. The only people you've ever really cared about. Besides Billy, kind of. Yeah. I was the pretty one. <laughs> but they were my passionate partners in unholy mischief. Mischief? Is that what we're calling murder? <laughs> hey, some of the things they did could be considered mischief. For old times sake. Can nothing be done? <laughs> Including soul eating. <laughs> no. <laughs> my doing has been my undoing. You did a dude that you shouldn't have did. <laughs> what is this feeling? I think it is my heart. I fear it is breaking. I must find a way. And luckily, there's always a way. I must find a way. Books are sap. Thou art a new witch. Only a witch in her coven can manifest what is written. So she actually felt bad for her. <laughs> yeah, and Winifred literally wouldn't have been able to do it now, I think, because she has no coven. Yes, true. Wilt thou help me? You're willing to give up your powers? My powers are nothing without my sisters! Book chose you. Can we name him? No. Okay. His name is Book. <laughs> Sounds a little... The spell for reuniting. Okay, human. <laughs> it stays that way. We cast the spell to reunite. What is meant to be together will be now until forever. So binding them together? I still think they made them bad guys. And where are they? Didst thou speak the spell correctly? I'm just not totally sold on the redemption arc they're trying to sell. For the witches here? Yeah. I don't know if I'd call it a redemption arc. Yeah. The spell doesn't bring them back. Oh. It sends you to them. Oh. Yeah. Oh, they just fucking straight up killed her. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh my god! So she gets to spend the rest of eternity with her sisters, probably in hell. <laughs> Which I think she's gonna be happy about, so... Yeah. Oh, how <laughs> Yeah, they seemed very keen on that in the last movie. Wins for everybody. Yeah. And no souls were eaten, I think, right? Yeah, not this yeah, time. No. Thank you. And how lucky art thou to have each other. Sisters! That's okay. Fun. Yeah, actually, that's kind of like the only way they could have pulled that off. Just considering what they did in the first film, it's not really any coming back from that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you see what I mean? Where, like, it's actually a pretty good story. Yeah, it's actually a very good continuation, especially by emphasizing that the magic wasn't necessarily the bad thing. Aww. Yeah. Book is sad. Uh, letting go of his old family. Yeah. Are they gone? Forever gone? No. No. Gone as in never, ever, ever just, coming back. Just until the next reboot. I love how they're saying that as if they know, like, yeah, we might do another movie. Stop! Yes. 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 We're here to help. You're a little late for that. No way. Oh, thank God. I can't believe he's still alive. He's perfectly on time. I didn't know what I was going to do. I was like, first move is to come in bold, like... Yeah. It's been like hey. this the whole day. Is your next move to cop a slap in the face, maybe? Yeah. Over here! I talked! 
No, oh, the things are gone. I can oh, yeah. speak. I mean, Winnie's gone, so. Yeah. Body to your head I here. I am not speaking to you. Now give me my bones. Give me my bones. Don't you drop me. Come here, bone daddy. He just wants a good boning. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the girls are like, can you get to stop? <laughs> stop talking like that. <laughs> it is about time. <laughs> Look, it's fine. Love who you love, but just, I don't need to hear it. <laughs> Their final destruction undoes all the spells of that wretched troll, Winifred Sanderson. Oh, he's finally free now. Winifred's boyfriend. Oh, what? actually, no. Yes. Actually, no. no. Uh, hey. But yes. that's, that's exactly what's that. Nope. Yes. We're gonna recorrect this. Yeah. I'm gonna make sure everybody knows the truth, Billy. He's gonna have to keep doing that for a while. Yeah. Thank you. Gonna take some work. You're not nearly as vile as I thought. I love how his whole deal is just, I don't want to be remembered as one of the people with her. Yeah, right. Okay, I was not into it. Yeah. My eternal rest. She kissed me? Kissed it was at a graveyard. Like I owe you an apology. Actually, I owe all of you. Just, yeah. just an apology? That's it? It actually worked out pretty good. That apology is going to consist of a lot of favors. <laughs> just no more magic candles. Absolutely. Deal. Magic items of others, you know, varieties, totally. But yeah. not the candle. Take book back, you know, to the... No, no, no. He's staying. Actually, I think I'm going to keep it. Book could use a new home. Yeah. We'll see you at the shop. Yes, you will. Discounts? Yes, actually. 20% wow. off. 10% no. off. Wait, what? <laughs> hey, he's still going to make a living. What movie do you guys want to watch tonight? Are we not going to talk about what just happened tonight? Because I feel like I missed a lot. Yeah. What's to talk about? You weren't there. You were having a party. It was a relatively normal night, okay? I guess if you consider resurrecting evil witches, finding out your best friend <laughs> is a witch, as missing out no. until you missed out. Or, you know, regular old Halloween. Oh, yeah. Well, you know, moving forward, it might be. Yeah. You're a witch now. You can make this a regular occurrence. And the walk. Nice. Naturally. Of course. Guys, what do we do? <laughs> I don't know. What? What is that? That's from the Walgreens. That's that walk from the Walgreens. Yes. <gasps> Seriously? Oh, uh, and there's the... Uh... Yeah, but it's the walk from the Walgreens, or it's the walk by the witches. Yeah, Why yeah, is yeah. the fact that it was at Walgreens know, right? the part that you remember the most? <laughs> the Walgreens walk. They needed to plug it one more time. Yeah, what? and yeah. What? We were running wild! So they did a whole recording studio bit. Oh, fantastic. Just for fun. You know what, though? This reminds me of those, like, times where they used to do, like, blooper reels mm -hmm. in movies and yeah. stuff. The witches are back! Oh! fun you know this is even almost better in the sense it's not real bloopers yeah no 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 like, i love the fake bloopers yeah fake blooper <laughs> or just like fun bit at the end that yeah. you would do at the end of some movies to, to just, make the credits more interesting yeah just end it on a fun note indeed witches the witches are back watch the way that we fly <laughs> I think they actually did a really good job of redeeming the idea of like the Sanderson sisters did evil things. Magic itself is not evil. A bit more of a um, charmed kind of vibe to it or the craft. The ridiculous fun version, mm. but yes. Okay. Yeah. See, I didn't actually see this when I watched the movie when it came out. Right. Oh yeah, there you go. There's another black flame candle. Number two. Yeah. Oh, you made another one. Well, either okay. he made another one or someone cataloged another one. Whatever. There's another one. Okay. Yeah, yeah so they got another one lined up. <laughs> they sure do. So yeah, can you see what I mean where it's like, it might actually be better than the first one. Yeah. I mean, I don't know. I don't know about better. I think they just work in tandem with each other really well. Well, look at it this way. I'm not saying whether anyone should or shouldn't enjoy the first or the second one more. Mm. No. I mean, technically, the storyline is better. Oh, the jokes yeah, are funnier. Yeah, because it's more it's more well made. More deliberately put together. Yeah. yeah. I mean, like, technically speaking. And yeah. I don't just mean on production. I mean, yeah. like, it's, I think it's more well written. Yeah, more well yeah. written. Fair enough. I you mean, know, look, more cohesive. Overall, I just think that they did a really good job translating a story that's nearly 30 years old into a modern context mm. while keeping a lot of the charm and, like, shit that made it fun to begin with, but also polishing off the stuff that maybe needed a little work. Well, absolutely. They kept the things that were good shitty, they kept and the things that were just <laughs> shitty they just shitty fixed. shitty yeah yeah they fixed yeah no absolutely agree until the next one though you've been with sam steph from where, where the, the movie, movie buds, buds.